Hello everybody, welcome into another Final Final Fantasy IX stream. Uh, I was, um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I was I was playing some uh, Overwatch before stream and uh, didn't realize what the time was. <laughs> so that's why we're a little bit late, but not too much, you know, just just a little bit. Um, <laughs> anyways, let's let's hop on into the game. Um, so we left off. Whoa, jumping around. We left off um, last time. What? My controller is being weird. It's not like really doing things. So, we left off last time with Eiko being kidnapped by Kuja. Uh, we escaped from the desert palace, but Eiko is now taken, and um, I don't know why we know that Eiko is here in Esto Gaza. The Black Mage just told us, I, I would assume. Yeah, I'm actually not sure why we why we know that we needed to come here, but we we know that we need to come here. Um, we did the uh, friendly feather circle here and everything, uh, so we are all caught up. We of course visited Esto Gaza already once before uh, before we needed to be here, and it didn't really help. There wasn't too much to do here. Um, we bought like the mithril claws, I think, from here, and that's about it. Um, you could get a get a wing edge. Whoa! I was. I don't remember you would end up fighting things out here. Well, some Garudas. Actually, now I remember Garudas around this place. Um, okay. Stop. No, you. Ah, Amaranth got stopped. Uh, does Garuda teach something? I feel like Garuda actually actually tastes bad, but I'm gonna give it a try. They do also cast a pretty pretty strong magic. Then again, I also have some pretty strong magic. Show enough meat here. Um, I know can eat until it's weaker. Okay, Queena. Let's see if Meteor works. Nope. So, hey, you know I like to... I like to learn things about Final Fantasy games. I actually don't... I don't think I know how... What, what um, determines Meteor's success or, or what kind of success chance it has. I'm gonna look that up. Okay, so no eating. We, we should just kill this. Yep, 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 yep. This is becoming kind of dangerous. If they just stop everybody, then that's... Rip. Good, good, good. Crit kill and then a flare. Whoa! Got my controller. No worries, no worries. Let me let me look that up. Uh Meteor in Final Fantasy Nine. Meteor is a black magic spell. Ignores magic defense and can miss. Um Deals random damage with chance of doing extreme damage. Um, it's got an interesting damage formula. Its accuracy is level divided by two plus spirit. Okay, okay. So this is another instance where Vivi, Vivi benefits from high, uh, high spirit, which isn't... I feel like it's, it's, yeah, I feel like spirit is mostly one of those things that is, like, accuracy for Vivi, um, while magic is then damage, more power, more power, um, 
But it's interesting, it also takes into account levels. So Vivi's... Vivi's, um... It would be 15 plus 27. So, yeah, not very high at all at this level. Um, so I suppose Vivi just needs to get more levels for Meteor to be more useful. But yeah, I did not know that it was tied to level. Uh, classic Phoebe. What do you beggars want? You are in a holy place. Keep the noise down. Hmm, just like the other pointy hat. No manners at all. Hey, mister. What did you say? Have you seen some guys that look like my friend here? How dare you address me so? I am the priest of Esto Gaza. The holy place in which you stand. Mind your tongue, child. Are you in league with that brazen crew? Tell me where they went. Was there a little girl with them? My friend's life is in danger. Tell me what you know, now. All life is equal. The living will return to the stars. Through the path, souls of, of the shimmering island. What are you talking about? Didn't the black mages have a girl with them? She's our friend. Didn't everyone from the black mage village come here? Tell me. I just watched them. Besides, they didn't do anything wrong. They barged in, hundreds of them. So that was the dreaded black mage army. They headed straight to for Mount Gulug without even looking at me. Mount Gulug? An enormous volcano that went extinct in the days of old. Legend has it that a race of great moles once lived within the caverns. But that was very long ago. No mortal has entered those depths ever since the entrance was mysteriously sealed. They passed through here and went straight to Mount Gulug. And? What about the girl? Oh yes, one of the black mages carried a little girl too. That's gotta be Echo. Well, now we know. We gotta get to Mount Gulug. Black mages were carrying a little girl. Thanks. I don't think the shop change changes. Oh, it does. We can buy some Zorlin shapes in here. Uh, flames, sabers, heavy lances, scissor fangs, suras rods, hamlins, and octagon rods. Uh, Armor-wise, we can get some Nkai armlets. We can get some jade armlets. Venetian shields. Black hoods. Not doing too well with the with with the money situations. Some red hats. Power vests. All right, we're good. We're good. Kind of kind of running low-ish on money though. Gotta keep an eye on that. Um. Although soon we'll be able to get infinite money, so it is fine. Out of my way! Hello. I got a letter this morning, but I don't know who sent it. I'm scared, Kupo. Read it with me. From Artemision to Magrika. Magrika, I'm in trouble. I used too much. Do you have more? You don't, do you? Oh, what am I gonna do? I told Artemision not to use it. I have a favor to ask, Kupo. I want you to deliver a letter to Mulan. Okay. Thanks, Koopa. Um, have we met Mulan? I feel like yes. The Shimmering Isle. Hmm. Mulan might also be here in Mount Gulag, though. We'll have to see.
Mount Gulug. Which comes with a with a theme that is a remix of Mount Gulug from Final Fantasy 1, of course. Um no, I think we need to go left first. No wait, we need to go right first. No wait, we need We need to go left first. <laughs> Nine thousand six hundred and ninety-three gil. Bulletin board. Don't forget to pull the lever down when you first use the well. Sla the mole. Whoops. <laughs> so, mole people lived here, and uh, one of their name, one of one of theirs was named. Uh, Slaw the mole. I want a I want a human who's named something the human. Red hat. Oh yeah, we did get like new stuff, so we should check. Um, Zolin shape is a little bit worse than angel bless. No. Um. I mean, I don't know. It's it's kind of a trade-off here between. Ah, eh, we'll keep the green berry on. Dane here. I'm pretty sure Zdane has already, like, almost all the all the stuff that we're gonna be needing. Anything possible to be learnt. It's already been learnt. Ooh, Octagon Rod gives us the third level magic elemental spells. Um, for Vivi. Oh, I was expecting uh, Black Hood to actually increase um, magic. It does not, but it does give uh, protection from elements, so let's equip it. And uh, black robe, I guess. For Vivi, it's also auto float. Scissor Fangs gives us aura, so we should learn that. Not much of a difference, anyway. Accuracy up, alert, auto host, uh, restore HP, healer. Uh, let's give Amarant actually. Long reach. Queena can get locomotion. I thought Queena would already have had locomotion from something, but I guess not. Um, let me check. Does uh, Vivi have anything from the light robe? Yeah, auto regen. So let's give Vivi the light robe instead. Uh, Queena could have the. Sure, it, it gives a huge bonus to defense, so let's give Queen of the Black Robe for now. So we're getting some pretty good, um, pretty good stuff here now. Ability-wise. Very powerful abilities. Um... Restore HP uh, is one that is kind of... I've never really used it. Um, I don't know if it's useful in like particular situations or something. Um, HP 20 would be nice, but we don't really have that money for it right now. Counter would also be kind of nice. 
Oh yeah, we're actually going to be needing body temp in here. This place is going it, to... It'll be nice to have body temp because things, things around here are going to use heat. And I don't want to mess, mess around with that. Um, there was something else that we also should have. But I'll probably remember it when we get there. Um, Amaranth's still waiting for that. No, we, we have returned magic on Amaranth now. Um, we could trade something around here. Add status for a little bit more health, because Amaranth's health is not that great. Let's go with that. Um, Queena... Oh yeah, did I give Amaranth actually um, body temp? No. So, not that then. Body temp, and then, I guess, gamble defense and add status. Uh... Queen, I could go auto haste. But we do also need a buddy temp. Not high tide. Let's go auto haste, gamble defense, MP up. Sure. That works. So now Queen is gonna be speedy. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I just. I forgot we're playing Final Fantasy IX. Uh, I've been I, I've been playing Final Fantasy VIII off stream, so I've got that on my mind. Auto haste is not that good. Um, we could do absorb MP, which um, which kind of just helps. Yeah, let, let's do that. It it, it helps Queen maintain MP. I do kind of wish that um, auto haste was better, or haste in general was better. As it is traditionally. Spooky. Hmm. Thought there was some items here. Guess not. Oh yeah, it's these these things that use uh, heat. <laughs> The vapors. Got a grenade here as well. Or vapors. They probably won't like a Blizzaga, I would assume. Cannon. All elemental attacks have no effect on Vapor. Well then, this is not going to have an effect on it then. Tastes bad. Let's try, uh, maybe the bomb tastes good? Or a grenade. I don't remember. I, I think we already have. I, I think you could learn Mustard Bomb from the Vapors. And we already have it, so... That doesn't really help. Christine! Hello, Christine. How's it going? Eat. Taste bad! Okay. Well, it all tastes bad. Isn't that life, Queena? Let's shout out maybe Christine. Christine was playing some uh, Holo Knight earlier. Um, that's 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 not it. That's uh, Last of Us One. <laughs> going great, and yourself? I'm doing good. I I had good food, and now. Playing some Final Fantasy Nine. Um, no, 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 no. We need to keep going this way. I could have sworn there was treasure in there. 
But I think there's like two buildings that look pretty much the same. Chest. Golden hairpin. Um... Auto region and loudmouth. I don't know. Oh! The Zidane can learn auto region from that one. Um, raises water element as well. Hello? Hello? Anything else? Oh! Bulletin board. Did everyone know you should pull the lever down at the end? Maureen the mold. I know. I know. Thank you. The whole place is just filled with hints about pulling the lever. Nope. Don't jump. Nope. <laughs> Not gonna work. Um... Over here? Hmm. I'm not confused about this place now. Demon's mail. Uh, we did have already some demon's mail, didn't we? So that's not gonna offer us anything new. Oh, sorry, demon's mail is, is heavy armor. Yeah, yeah, we already got it. Koopo! Um, Mugtaka. Can I help you, Kupo? I haven't received any mail lately, Kupo. Alright, what's your mug shop then? Uh, nothing really. Thanks, though. I mean, this is where we are supposed to be going. Oh wait, can we open the chest right now? Nope. I thought you had to go somewhere else to uh, to trigger the dragon. Steel. Red dragon. Oh, Queen just outright died. Return magic. Also, we should have, uh, we have revive, so let's use that on Queena. How would you like that? Give me your own magic back at you. And, uh, let's draw a flare. Stole a tent. Whoop. I don't think there's anything in particular to steal. Do some white, uh, white wind here. Hopefully, it doesn't twist her again. Dives an amaranth for 23 damage. Oof. Um. Um. I don't know. Chakra on Queena. <laughs> do something. Let's see if Queena can eat this one. Eat. Well, it's dead. Oh, yeah. Vivi is a killer. Absolute murder. Auto float learnt on Zidane. So I don't think Zidane can now learn anything from any anything down here. We had oh, oh we can we can we can learn auto life and auto haste. Um, 
Let's grab auto haste next. Fix it. This is a great remix of the original theme. Let's check the other side. Hey, we have Mulan. Okay, Mulan's over here. Uh, give Mulan a letter. A letter from Magrika. Thanks, Kupo. Artemision rubbed it all over himself. The machine needs it to function properly, Kupo. I know, know how he must have felt. I used it on myself once, too. It's a wonderful thing, but... I see, that's why we haven't been receiving mail lately, Kupo. Yep, you want me to deliver to Mogtaka, alright. I'll head over there. I mean, you could do it yourself, but... I get it, I get it. I get it. I heard you should pull the lever down a second time, Une the Mole. Second um, reference to Une. Interesting. Gaia Gear. Did you hear? Pull the lever. Hello, dragon. Alright, another one of these. Oh, two. Well then. I mean, these are actually, like, super dangerous if you're... If you're, um, coming in here unprepared. The twister can really just, like, wipe everybody out. Especially in this one where you have two of them. Survive. Let's get a flea uh, flare. And... Well, let's see what happens. Do we get another twister? Yep. Things might go bad here. Yep, queen us down as well. I mean, Amaranth's just like returning magic here. Like crazy. I do want... Whoops. No auto battle. I do want uh, Return Magic on Vivi as well. Then if we have Vivi and Amaranth in the party, we'll just keep keep spamming spells back at the enemy team if they do something like that. Let's manage this down to one dragon and then... Then um, I'll see about eating one. Aerial Slash. Not magic. Revive. Oh yeah, I guess like now Amaran should not have, um, now that I think of it, should not have um, MP attack because Amaran's gonna start needing MP. Dive, and let's see if it survives. We can do a do an eat. It lives. Let's see if we get some good food. I know can eat until it's weaker. How much weaker does it need to be? How much health does it have? Oh, Amaranth might just kill it now. Maybe it's at least like immune to. Oh, Amaranth is a lot. Is dead. Um, well, that's, that's helpful. Um, but, um... What was I gonna say? I lost it. Anyways. Oh yeah, you learned Twister. Well, unsurprising. <laughs> um, so now we got that one. Good, good, good. Uh, we should probably use a tent. But yeah, um, Amaranth should not have... MP attack on 
Could instead grab some more health while I'm around. Yeah. Does Vivi have access to return magic? No. No, no, no. Again, there are some mad combos you can do with Vivian. Vivian, some of those, um, some of those abilities. Well, let's go deliver this letter. Oh, it's upstairs. Uh, Moktaka, here's a letter. Thanks for the delivery, Kupo. From Mulan to Moktaka. Artemisia used the item on himself, Kupo. I wanted to go to Magnus Central and complain, but where the heck is it located, Kupo? I never even thought about it until now, Kupo. Come to think of it, I don't really know much about Magnus Central. I haven't received any mail lately. Alright. I don't feel like there was any sort of gotcha moment here with you needed to go and talk to the other Moogle again. Yeah. Just making sure. Uh, pull down. Pull down. Pull down. Three times. These red dragons really just like surprising you through, through the walls. Alright, now let's just take them out ASAP. Lair, and we could use Twister on them. It didn't seem all that powerful when returned from Amaranth, but it could be more powerful when Bina uses it. Let's see. Queena doesn't have any wind boosters on, I don't think. Meh. Meh. Get a heal in here, White Wind. Oh, unless Queena dies. Yep. Is Queena's magic defense really, really bad, or what? What is the case? Oh. Oh. Nice. Apparently, their claws have have a uh, add status on them. Uh, wait a minute, what was that? Vivi got auto potion? No? Auto float. There we go. Uh, then... We can get auto life on Vivi. I like that Vivi learns stuff like auto life very quickly. While some of the other characters take forever to learn it. Whee! Using potions to heal up at this point is, uh... Takes a while to click through... But we might as well use up the potions. Um, did we need any MP? Not really, you know. Pretty sure there was uh, something that we had in here. No? Okay. Dane, it's Echo. Kuja and the Black Mages are there too. Echo, that must be the extraction spell. I hate this too. Eidolon of eternal life. Eidolon of infinite power. Rise from thy eternal slumber. Depart from something. Let there be life. Let there be light. The time is now. The time has come.
exclamation marks. <laughs> Aiko's just standing back there now. <laughs> we all know how you feel, Dagger, so leave this to us, okay? Come on, let's do it. Do I have brought Dagger in my party? No. I don't want... Dagger can't concentrate on this one. Wait. I thought we could get to our menu. Oh no, I wanted to switch things around. We need antibody for this next fight. That was odd. Odd that was. We fail again. Again we have failed. Did you make some mistake? Make mistake I did not. Yours the mistake must be. I made no mistake at all. The truth, do you speak? Of course I speak the truth. Will you two just shut up? It's his fault. His fault it is. The one who messed up is you. You're the one who messed up. I said shut up. I don't want to hear excuses. I sense power from within her. Continue the extraction. Continuing further will endanger the subject's life. Only at the age of 16 can Eidolons be extracted. You two just don't get it. I need an Eidolon more powerful than Alexander. An Eidolon with the power to bury Garland. His powers are so incredible, I cannot even come close. I must destroy him before Terra's plan is activated, or my soul will no longer be my own. Who cares if she lives? I want that Eidolon. Koopa. Where did that come from? You get out of the way. Master, master. Koopa. Well? Koopa. Our pet Moogle is interfering with the extraction process. Certain are we that this it caused the failure. Kill the runt. We are running out of time. Koopo. Marg. No, Marg. Hide behind me. Marg. What is it? Echo. Thank you for everything. Marg. What are you saying? Don't worry, Koopo. I will always be with you, Koopo. Marg. This way? Whoa. Marg. We will put you to death. Put you to death, we will. Eiko, use Terra Homing, Kupo. Okay. Terra Homing. That's a big Moogle. I wanted to be by your side, Eiko. So I became Marg. Don't worry, I'll always watch over you, Kupo. Exclamation marks. Eiko, are you okay? I'm alright. Marg saved me. I never knew that Marg was an Eidolon. She always looked after me, disguised as a mogul. Even though, even though she was weak, she fought her best to protect me. So that's what happened. Marg's ribbon. Marg. 
Received ribbon. It's all right, Echo. Margul always watch over you. You're right. How can that... That Moogul went into a trance. Pooja. So, an eruption of anger against one's surroundings induces a complete trance. It's not the will to live, nor is it the desire to protect another. Man, you're really going off. Hello? That means I simply need a powerful soul, even if that soul is not my own. No, wait. And it can be found there. Ha 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 ha. what are you plotting? I'm done with you. Wait a minute. Vivi, look out. Don't worry, I hear these twins put on quite a good show. Of course, they're really not twins at all. Wait, what about the black mages? No, Vivi, it's too dangerous. Whoa. Dane, something's wrong. I thought we defeated them. Okay, so we are not prepared for this fight. Um, but... That's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, let's start off with some uh, defenses here. Let's get Mighty Guard going. We, of course, got a Steel, Melody, Gemini. Hmm... I mean, Aura's gonna give, like, um, auto life, so... That could be handy. I mean, why not? Do some auto lifing. Viral smoke. Yeah, that's the thing that I don't want. Now, you're all carrying a virus, too. Still a golden hairpin. Uh, wait a minute, we need, um... Mm, vaccines. Hold on, do we have... Oh, we never got Angel Snack, so I'm not, I'm not sure if it even works on Virus, but... Um, that could have been nice. But I guess while we are waiting for Zdane to steal, we can vaccinate the whole team. Wings. The big thing is that I would have wanted to have antibody because um, Melty Gemini uses uh, venom quite a bit, if I recall correctly. Um, I don't know if there was anything else ready to cast right now. Little tree deathless? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it'll work. You can always try. Um, let's drop some more auras. Put in steel. I mean, what do we have left? I should maybe detect. It didn't say miss, so I'm going to assume it worked. All right, let's have everybody else hold for now. Oh, you probably do a heal. Demon's Vest. Yeah, that one we want. That's what I was thinking about with uh, Demon's Mail earlier. Uh, Demon this Venom Powder. There it is. Uh, antidote. 
for the steal. We can then go crazy after this. After we get the steel, we can go for all the big, big attacks. Wings is good, because it's barely anything. Bit of steel. Bio on everybody. Do we get any? Yep, a few poisons. Uh, we can do, do some panacea here and throw in a nice little antidote as well. Couldn't steal. Okay, wings hit Echo pretty hard. Oh, I forgot about the auto life. Um, let me try a shock rat Echo as well. Good not steal. Bio, if that's on all, Echo's gonna die again. Nope, just Queena. No steel. Venom powder on somebody. Uh, Panacea cures Venom as well. Oh, it missed. So it doesn't even matter. I mean, I guess Wings could be doing a lot of damage to Zidane as well, but we don't know because Zidane is not taking any damage here. He's taking misses. I think Ego has just, yeah, enough to hold, hold that off. Well, there we go, Demon's Best. Now we can go in. Go in hard. Oh, we do need some heals, though. Um, oof. Please target just a single team. Nope, not Echo, please. Okay, we need to bring Echo back up. I'm thinking about using maybe, maybe Carbuncle, so we get some protection from that. Let's revive Echo. And let's get a White Wind in here. And maybe another Mighty Guard as well. Yeah, let's bring uh, Carbuncle to protect against Bio. I recall Melted Gemini being a pretty rough fight, which I, I'm pretty sure I lost to the first time I was playing. And the worst thing about this fight is the preceding part, because, um, well, of course, like the save Moogle, the save Moogle was before the whole section that we, we had here. Uh, we have to go for an antidote here now. Now we are well protected. But yeah, like, you, you need to go through the whole cutscene with Marg being summoned and everything. 
it, it, it's not not nice. Bio, well, that's just gonna hit yourself. What? How did it hit Queena? Queena, where's, where's your where's your reflect? You fool. Crit. Uh, Queena does need a heal as well. I'll wait for the next move. Wings and Echo misses. Miss! There we go. He lit it. But yeah, it's annoying because of the preceding cutscenes. You have to go through it all. Alright, everybody learns something. Vaccines. Vivi, where's Kuja? Did he get away? Vivi? Everyone knew he was lying, but they still followed him. He said that our lifespans can't be extended, and that we were fools for believing him. What? Kuja said that? Uh, I'm so sorry, for all I've done. You guys don't have to apologize. Where are the others? They were so shocked to hear it. They're all sitting down over there. Zdane, what am I supposed to tell them? Vivi. Hey, Vivi, where are you going? All I can do is just sit with them. Bastard. When I get my hands on him. Poor Vivi. Part of me, but what is going on here? Or something. <laughs> I don't read the message. <laughs> Went automatically. Who might you be? Where has that uh, Kuja gone? Oh, him. He's split, lady. What? You chased him away? I know not who you are, but you have my sincere gratitude. Dot dot dot. Who this be? Princess Garnet. Why, it is... it is you. Dot dot dot. Oh, how long it has been. I haven't seen your highness for ages. Why, look how you've grown. So, whatever brought you to this dreadful place? Who is this lady? What's a friend of yours doing here anyway? Oh, my darling, Ribbit. Hilda, I finally found you, Ribbit. I do not remember ever marrying a toad. I, uh, it's me, Ribbit. Sid. Of course, that moustache. It really is you. Hilda, come back to the castle, Rivet, and return me to my former self, Rivet. I'm dreadfully sorry, my su sugar cup, but I surrendered your favorite airship to a man named Kuja. Forget about it, Rivet. As long as you're all right, Rivet. Oh, my sweet froggy woggy. So, uh, you know Kuja? I'm gonna make him pay. Please tell me all about him. Very well, my dear. I shall tell you everything once we reach Limbloom. Whoa! That was a long way to teleport. <laughs> Robert Kuja didn't touch you, did he? His soul was filled with hate, but he was polite to me. He just talked to me an awful lot. What about Robert? Well... He divulged his master plan to me. I didn't even have to ask. It was tiresome. But what he spoke of, it was truly a scene from a nightmare. What did he say? That he was not of this world. He said his aim was to use this world to acquire an even more destructive power. The taking of Hildegard I was a part of his process. We must tell Zidane about this, Rivet. Your valuable information. Which lead me to believe that my abduction wasn't a part of this plan. He was a hopeless narcissist, but... 
But at least he was a skirt chaser like you. Ah, but you just hit me where it hurts most. Rivet, I'm sorry about that. That's why I risked my life to rescue you. Oh, really? Are you sure you weren't there to take back Hildegard 1? I'm not lying, Rivet. I apologize. So please return me back, Rivet. I'm sick of being an ogloff or a frog. I'll never cheat on you ever again, Rivet. I promise. Can your words be trusted? I don't like Rivet. I swear on my father's name. All right, I'll turn you back. But it's going to be much worse if you ever cheat on me again. I, I understand. Now turn me back. Maybe I'll turn you into Hedgehog Pie. Oh, uh, please no, Rivet. Now turn me back. All right, all right. Finally, Ribbit, I'm human again. Walk, I can concentrate on building Hildegard tree. Dot dot dot. Darn it. I must stop that. Yeah. I'm sorry about everything, Hilda. Sid is back. Dane. Hmm. Dagger? Mr. Zidane. Why are you calling me Mr. Zidane? Mr. Zidane, please get up. Oh, it was just a dream. What's up? Lady Hilda is calling a meeting. Please go to the conference room. Okay. I just wish I could have dreamt a bit longer. Huh? Oh, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. Goodbye. Back to Lin Bloom. What's up, Mogki? I have a fairy task, Koopo. I want you to deliver a letter to Kamal. Okay. Thanks, Koopo. Where's Kamal? I don't think we met Kamal. Have we? I don't think so. I also don't think there's any reason not to go to the conference room straight away. Upper level? Hmm, so stuff for us to do is, is to... We can do some synthesis, I think. Um, we should also go and uh, deliver the Stellatia coins. Because I think we have some that we haven't brought back yet. Who's that guy? It's Regent Sid. What? Still hasn't got any manners, Rib. Ahem. <clears throat> Still haven't learned your manners. You can stop the frog talk now. Silence, Ribbit. Oh well. Ugh. I don't gather you all to talk about that. I called for this meeting to tell you about what I learned while I in Kuta's captivity. It may provide a hint about where he may be. Listen carefully. I don't see the princess. I shall look for her. I will begin constructing Hildegard Tree. The blue Narcissus will be used for its construction. Now, Hilda will tell you the rest. Hilda? So, what did Kuja discuss with you? Some parts of the story may be hard to believe, but please hear me out. Kuja plans to use this world as a means of acquiring an even greater power. Greater power? What would he do with it? I don't know. He indicated that he wasn't off this world. What? 
We call our world Gaia, but he called his birthplace Terra. Terra, huh? ATE team. Tantalus team. Oh, well, the repair's coming. They're going really slow. We can't rush them or everything will probably fall apart again. We're not getting anywhere. I've been up here forever. I want to switch places with someone. I guess the damage is a lot worse than we expected. She's not here either. Huh? Where could she be? Yo! Oh, it's only you. Why are you all gathered here? Are you scheming another abduction or something? Hey, watch your mouth. We were just discussing ways to restore this district. Yeah. Old timer, you got us all wrong. Yeah. We're just trying to rebuild our home, that's all. What are you doing here? From the looks of you in your face, it seems like you got problems. What's troubling you? Maybe we can help. Uh, can I really trust you? Yeah? The princess is missing. She's not in the castle, so I figured she would be in town. Why don't you go back to the castle before you get lost? What? We'll find her. This is like our backyard. Alright, you heard me. Get moving. You have my gratitude. Hey, no prob. This terra seems to be connected with a place called the Shimmering Island. I don't know where Kuja went, but maybe we can find him if we go there. Unfortunately, you can't get directly to Terra from the Shimmering Island. Of course you can't. Everyone would have discovered this other world by now if it were that easy. So what do we do? I'll tell you. The gateway that connects the two worlds is sealed, but Kuja said there is a place where the seal can be broken. Where's that? He said it's an old castle located in the northern area of the Forgotten Continent. Well then, we were over there already. An explorer left a record of, this, of his trip to this particular castle on the Forgotten Continent. If I remember correctly, he wrote that the cliffs were too steep to explore. Other than that, very little is known about the Forgotten Continent. Well, since this castle doesn't have a name, Let's call it Ibsen's Castle. Ibsen's Castle, huh? Yeah, we don't know anything about the world beyond our continent. Recovery. How is the ship coming along? Regent, you're human again. Yes, now can we concentrate on building the ship? Judging by our experience with Hilda 2, we were, we are almost finished with the engine. We're having problems with the construction of the hull, though. Yes, I'm thinking about using a part of the blue Narsis for the body. How come? I realized that the blue Narsis was a well-built ship when I rode in it. There are other reasons, but we must hurry. I already have a completed blueprint in my head. Do as I tell you, and it will be completed in no time. Let's get ready. Roger. That's all I heard. You may find a clue if you go to Ibsen's castle. Did you ask Kuja about all of this? These are all things he discussed voluntarily. He became very impassioned, impassioned as he spoke. And he volunteered information without even my asking. He probably thought telling me his plans wouldn't affect his grand scheme. He's right. His power is great, and we are at a disadvantage. But I can't forgive Kuja. He toyed with my friends' lives. Now we know where we need to go. The problem is getting there. 
I guess we'll have to wait until Sid finishes building Hildegard Tree. Zdane, I bring you troubling news. What? What now? I cannot find the princess. I've looked all over Leanbloom. The members of Tantalus aided me in my search, but... He's not in Leanbloom? Then there's only one place. Do you know where she is? I think so. You guys wait here in Leanbloom. I'll be right back. Solo adventure! Again, just a cutscene. Jumping over to another one. Uh. Ah, where are you guys going? We're gonna go look for Dagger. Is there anyone else we need to look for? No, but we looked over there already. Go someplace where we haven't already looked. Ain't that so demanding? True, true. Hey, Ruby. Blank, Marcus, how y'all doing? We're doing all right. How's show business, Ruby? Well, the money ain't good, but I'm having fun. I like it. That's great. Our hideout in Limbloom got completely destroyed. It's gonna take a miracle to fix the place. Bro, we better... Oh, sorry. Uh, we came to Alexandria for a reason. Have you seen Dagger? Dagger? No, I, I ain't seen her. What about her? You fixing to kidnap her again? No, we're just looking for her this time. I was only kidding, Marcus. I'll ask the patrons to be on the lookout. Thanks, Ruby. I wonder if Zdane is here with these good old boys. This is strange. I was sure that she'd be back in Alexandria. <laughs> Again, the trip from Lindblom to Alexandria is not a short one, but Zidane just kind of ran over here. Where else can I look? Hey, Zidane, I've been looking for you. Boss, have you found Dagger? Nah, can't find her anywhere. I don't find Dagger, but I think I saw that chick. That chick? Yeah, you know, that chick. I'm gonna check again. Hey, wait, who is she? What are you talking about? Where are you going, boss? Is she here? She was standing over there just a second ago. Over there? Is that who I think it is? Hey! Ah, over there! Requires, requires some yakety sacks instead of... Instead of Rosa May. <laughs> Where did she go? alive, eh? You are... Baku. Yep, I'm the man who abducted your princess. Let us forget about that. It happened a long time ago. You got a big heart, unlike that knucklehead Steiner. No wonder the women are running the show here. Wahahaha. Boss, you must have seen Beatrix. Hey! Wahahaha. <laughs> Hello, Cerulean. Welcome in. How are you doing? As you can see, Alexandria was completely destroyed. I know. We've been here, haven't we? Yeah, we've been here after it was destroyed. Thanks, Beatrix. No, wait. Wait, no. Zane hasn't been here after it was destroyed. Because... No. Wait. What? After Alexander got blown up, we woke up in a lean bloom. Right, 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 right. So we haven't technically been here. All right. Steiner and I did our best to protect Alexandria. 
but our efforts were in vain. Dinah was worried about you. Why haven't you contacted him? Dagger's still in shock. She's been mute ever since the attack. She is? Then it is better for her not to return to the city for a while. It won't do her any good to see Alexandria like this. Well, here's the thing. I can't find her. I thought she'd be back here, but I can't find her anywhere. She's back in Alexandria? But she's nowhere to be found. Have you looked in the resting place? Resting place? Yes. If she is back in Alexandria, I am certain that she will be there. There are a couple of favors I'd like to ask you. If you see Princess Garnet, please tell her not to worry about Alexandria. She must take care of herself first. Sure, what else? I'd like to give something to her. Received Garnet! Maybe it will help the princess get through this time of uncertainty. I mean... If I'm feeling sad, I will stop feeling sad if somebody gives me, like, precious gemstones. <laughs> hey! Found them. I've been looking for you, Dagger. Zdane. You can talk again? I... I've been thinking since... Disaster. I've been thinking that I have to become a queen and bring back peace to Alexandria. That's why I came back here, but... Can I stay with you guys for a while longer? Can I ask why? When my mother was still alive, my primary concern was how to talk and look like a princess. Those were the only things on my mind. That didn't change when my mother died and I was about to become a queen. I only thought about how to look and act like a queen. I don't think the people will accept me as their queen the way I am right now. I don't know about that. I have no right to rule over this country. Hmm. Oh, I almost forgot. Beatrix wanted me to give you give this to you. Is this a garnet? That's right. Isn't it pretty? It's beautiful. That gem used to be just another ordinary stone. The stone made a wish. I want to shine. The stone traveled from person to person in keeping with its wish. And now it's shining in your hand, Dagger. If you're willing to make an effort, you'll shine too someday. The day will come when Alexandria needs you. There's no rush. The important thing is to have the desire. Thanks. I have to apologize for using you guys as an excuse to run away from my responsibilities. Hey, what's important is that you honestly want to stay with us. Dane. Can I borrow that knife again? Uh, which one? The one that helped me make my last big decision. I'm borrowing this. To steals it. Dane. Remember the, the, remember the way I was. For me. Dagger's gonna go stab some people. That is a sharp knife, though. That was also a pretty good haircut for just, you know, 
knifing a ponytail. What happened? What happened to your hair? Oh, princess, what have you done? I know Zidane broke your heart, didn't he? How dare he? I is that true? Whoa, hold on, don't jump to conclusions. Zidane's right, Echo. Dagger, you can talk again. Yes, I'm sorry I made you all worry. It's okay, but your hair, it was so beautiful. Short hair doesn't suit me. Oh no, you look great. Thanks, Seiko. It's still too early to celebrate. Erin, you know our destination? Yes, Ibsen's castle on the Forgotten Continent. That's right. We'll go there to find out how to enter Terra through the Shimmering Island. I'm sure we'll find out more about what's going on once we reach Terra. Yeah, and hopefully we'll learn about what Kuja wants to achieve. The location of Phipps's castle has been marked on the map based on Lady Hilda's information. Please check by pressing select after we depart. You can also press A on the bright spots on the map and the ship will take you to those locations automatically. You can check how, how to maneuver the ship automatically by pressing Y while the large map is open. Excuse me. Uh, please let me know if you'd like to switch out to your party members. I shall assist you in any way that I can during your journey. You don't have to be so formal. Let's just relax and enjoy our flight. Now Dagger's happy. Cutting your hair makes you happy. I'm gonna bring Dagger in now. Um, I would love, like to also bring Aiko in. Are we just gonna double white mage this? Let, let's go with level. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's it's gonna be it's gonna be Dagger, Aiko, and uh, Steiner. Airship navigation things. I maybe should have read that. <laughs> it's been a while since I, I flew with this thing. Alright, so we're not going to be going to Ibsen's castle. We just got our airship. Of course we're not going to go on, go there. We've got a ton of things to do now before that. Um, let's start by... Um, let's start by doing some Chocobo stuff. Why not? Uh, we can. I think we can now finish the Chocobo quest altogether. So let's do that. I feel like the Hildegard music is is. I, I don't know. It's not the best, but it's it's a good good um, airship theme though. It's not the best, but but it's good. Anyways, now we can, uh, let, let's get through the equipment stuff again. Um, oh, we already have everything from Demon's Best. Well then. Um, it is a pretty good upgrade though, so let's give it to Zidane here. Um, so, Dagger is... Um, so, so, in Final Fantasy XII, Bosch, in Final Fantasy IV, Cecil and in Final Fantasy IX, Dagger are, I do believe, the three characters in Final Fantasy games that change the menu portrait during the game. Um, I th think we got pretty much everything. We can learn Cura from something else as well, so we don't need to learn that. We can have Whale Whisker and Dagger. Golden hairpin for for some magic. I mean, Dagger's apparently learnt everything already. Oh wait a minute! I should actually. What I should do is, um, I kind of. What one thing that I kind of dislike is the fact that you know, you need to go into the airship to change your party members. You can't just menu it. Um, we should go ahead and uh, unequip everything from everyone else uh, who's not in the active party.
So I'll just grab uh, Amaranth stuff as well. Even though we won't be doing any fighting now, <laughs> I realize, but um, this is. This will make us ready for when we do. Steiner, Echo. Alright. Because I think um, Dagger might learn something. Nope, doesn't learn anything. Um, I will unequip that though. Um, oh yeah, Echo is really, really falling behind on stuff. So Echo can learn both Full Life and Holy. Two very good things here. Mm. Half MP is also going to be nice, so I think we might just go for that and uh, jump backwards. Uh, now nah, let's just go in order here. Shell. Echo really just needs to get learning things. Locomotion. Armlets are done. Oh, uh, Garnet gives, um, let's learn, oh wait, 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 let's, uh, let's learn Madu and so let's go with Ribbon, 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 Medine, Ability Up, and Guardian Mog. Item that always keeps Mog besides you. Absorbs water and wind, uh, defends against fire, ice, thunder, and holy. So, very good. I mean, it doesn't give, uh, status protection like, like, um, ribbons usually do um, but it is quite nice quite nice indeed um, then Steiner's still holding on to the broadsword yeah this team needs some needs some training oh I mean actually we could before we do we before we do the chocobo stuff we could actually go and do some uh, some power leveling of uh, AP by doing the friendly monsters. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just give Jagger the white rope for now. And the garnet to learn Bahamut. Oh yeah. So, um, next friendly monster, I think... The Feather Circle told us to go and talk to Garuda. I think. So let's go. Um, Garuda is actually... Like, one of the first friendly monsters you can meet. But I don't think you have access to a Lapis Lazuli, which is what it... Uh, what it wants from you. Because this, this is the area that you can reach from Gizemluk Grotto. Um, which actually reminds me, do we have a Koopa Nut? I don't think we do, but... Uh, let me just check. E Koopa, 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 Koopa Nut. Koopa Nut. We do have a Koopa Nut. Okay, we should actually go and take that to... To Gizem Luke here. And this is also a power leveling place. Uh, I just realized we don't really have anybody who can help with this. <laughs> Whoops. Um, should we run away? We should run away. No, wrong thing. Uh, run away. Run away, please. Ooh, yeah. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, don't run away. Just flee. I forgot. This is the other. This is Final Fantasy IX. We need to use flee to get out of here. So yeah, this this is like an early power leveling place. If you if you want to have very powerful, uh, very very high level early on, um, you can come here through Gizemluk Grotto the first time you're around here. Hey, some Mughal children, um, and you can you can then use, for example, you can use um, you you could try Limit Glove, but you can also use a Mustard Bomb to cause heat on the Grand Dragon, which makes it kill itself by attacking you so that's another way of way of dealing with that early on Koopo you have Koopo not can I have it Koopo yes thanks Koopo take this extension thank you 
Bug me? Anything? I want more Koopa nuts. Uh, let's tent up. Get our people back up after that. Um, we should not get into fights with the Grand Dragons. Like, you can, you can beat the Grand Dragons. Oh yeah, tents don't resurrect. Okay. Echo. Get it done. Um, so the, the, uh, I, I think it's interesting how they have two characters in the game which are very similar to each other um, mechanics-wise, with Dagger and Echo both uh, sharing, you know, rackets, both being able to use white magic and summoning magic. Very, very like, very, very many similarities in that sense. Um, the main difference between them... Oh, I forgot Steiner's got the worst weapon on right now. <laughs> this is gonna be rough. Okay, let's, let's bring in Bahamut. Bahamut, save me! This is the worst team right now. Mega Flare! But yeah, like, uh, Echo is more of a white mage than a summoner. Echo only has access to, um, six summons. No, just four. Just four summons. Carbuncle, Fenrir, Phoenix, and Medin. And, um... I mean, we could bring Medin in as well. While Dagger has a lot more summons available. While Echo then has access to uh, the higher level white magic, like... Dagger doesn't learn holy or or uh, full life, for example. The friendly Garuda. Ooh, thank you. Hello. Lapis Lazuli. All right. There you go. Lapis Lazuli. Arg! 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 Thank you. 40 AP! <laughs> For a moment I was worried Dagger didn't learn anything. I mean, Dagger only learned Bahamut? And we got a diamond. Um, so this time we didn't get a hint about where to go, because I, I do believe we only have one more, um, one more creature to look for. Oh, by the way, before we go there, we should actually go and check if there's anything we can, um, synthesize, because... Because, yeah. Uh, Zidane does not have anything else to learn. Auto life and long reach. Okay, I lied. I lied. Um, let's switch power belt, body temp and distract, sure, 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 uh, nope, we're getting distract from there, auto float, we can get insomniac from there, I mean, we need body temp still, but I think we can go with body temp from something else. Um, what was it that gives? Well, the fairy earrings give body temp as well. Um, Medane's ring also gives body temp, so let's go for that. Mithril sword for armor break. Learn Bahamut. Let's learn a Thomas. Or Atomus. Mini? Okay, um Yeah, so before we go there, let's go let's go to to uh Lindblum to the synth synthesis shop and check um if there was anything else to get. Um I think it's gonna be Ah, uh, if we just, like, land over here. 
Because if we land on Lindblom, we get thrown into the castle. While here, we can go straight to the business district. So, I mean, this is also the time when we can um, get infinite money because we can do the cotton rope trick uh, by going between the Black Mage Village and uh, Lindboom. I'll take your weapons and make them a thousand times better. Did you have anything new? No. Huh. I was hoping for something new. Nope. Not really, no. Hmm. I mean, we probably should do do some uh, money making here, though, possibly. Checking that we got everything. Yep. Hold on. So Zidane is Zidane's missing a few more uh, a few more abilities, actually. Hmm. Strange. We don't like we don't have that much more equipment. To learn things from. All right. Well, let's go to the to the final friendly monster then. And I think we might actually no let's let, let's not do the cotton rope stuff yet i i'd like to have choco powered up for that oh wait a minute the hildegard uh, yeah hildegard actually can't land here so <laughs> i take it back we're going to do uh the chocobo stuff now because we need choco to be powered up a little bit Uh, wait a minute, wrong side. This one. Oh, but wait a minute, we do have a have an ocean chocobo now, so we can go wherever. Wah. Hope you're ready for some uh, mini gaming, because we are gonna mini game with the best mini game. That was ever minigamed. Um, so I did a tier list on Final Fantasy soundtracks. I'm thinking, I've been thinking of maybe uh, trying to compile a tier list of Final Fantasy minigames. Just so I can put all the Final Fantasy 7 minigames in in the bottom tier. What the? Wait a minute, where? Whoa, whoa. Oh, it was right here. I missed it. It, it. it spawned at the very same spot as where we were already. That was a bad one. Yeah. Godric Gill. Yeah, yeah, you give me extra time. I know, I know, I know. Played this game before. Official greens. Feeling like I'm I'm a little bit off in this game. My chocobo hot and colding is not really up to par now. Yeah, six in Lagoon. Six in Lagoon is not that great. Weh, 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 weh. So we're looking for, I think, Two chocograph pieces. 
is what we have left. Quack, 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 quack. This one's not going so well either. We're getting some lucky drops here though. Oh yeah. Weh. No chocograph pieces yet though. Got lucky with that one. Gotta find this one quick. Come on, Choco, come on. Ooh. Found it just in time. Or eight with zero seconds to spare. Not much bonus from that then. Um, hold on. Uh, so I wanted to see... Oh yeah, we can't get to our menu in this. Well, whatever. Uh, let's go. I think it is two chocograph pieces that we need. Well, I mean, we'll see. Um, Mena will tell us if there's anything more. Mena is very useful, except in that one instance about not uh, telling us that we can't find something until we have the airship. Chocograph piece, there we go. Got one of them. So again, I don't remember this for sure, but I'm pretty sure that you cannot find two Chocograph Chocograph pieces in one one uh, round. Time's up. How many points are we at? 4k. Mm. We need uh, 8,500 for the Protect Ring. Or 10k for the Robe of Lords. Um, I think we might want to take the Robe of Lords first because we're actually going to be getting a Protect Ring um, in a moment here anyway, so... Probably want to do a little bit of Choco grinding for that. For a quick little Robe of Lords. Because those we won't be able to get... Um, very soon. It'll take a while until we can get any Rover Lords, I think. Again, I think it's crazy that you, you theoretically, you can get that, which is like the ultimate um, Mage's Rogue. You can get that on this one <laughs> if you want to grind like crazy. Again, I don't think it's worth it. Um, it'll make your... It, it'll definitely, like, allow you to make BB your tank or something like that, but um, other than that, like, the abilities it teaches... Hmm, I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad. But uh, there, there, there's some very good abilities, but are they useful in on, on disc one? No. Come on, Choco! Uh, um, so, yeah, I don't know if it's really, like, worth it to spend however many hours you would have to play hard and cold in the forest uh, because for in the forest you can't really like grind points so easily as you can in lagoon like at the point when you can get the ocean chocobo i would say at that point it is more worth it to do it uh, because it, it won't take that long. You'll still have to grind quite a few uh, games of Hard and Cold, but it's less than in the forest. Always half the lagoon. 
I don't know. I mean, Hearth and Lagoon is also another. You could maybe do it with with uh, with a coastal chocobo. Lots of points coming in. Nothing we need, though. Yeah. I mean, you know, I, I enjoy trying to break these games oftentimes. Um, but I also, I actually also enjoy uh, trying out just like genuine cheats in, in these games. Like genuinely just like hacking the game with a, with a memory editor or something. And... Um, <laughs> Hard and cold is actually one where you can, you can easily just. Um, it, it's very easy to just use it, use cheat engine for example, and just look for the, um, look for the uh, timer for these games, and just freeze it at 60 and and just get tons of points for. Apparently, getting eight items with <laughs> 60 seconds to spare. Pretty funny how uh, early on in the forest you'll get like, I don't know, like 10 points of beak level with that. Dig, dig, dig! Antidote. Come on. Give me the peas. I have a feeling that it might be that we... No, like, there's, there's, I think there's one chocograph piece that you can find, like, either in the forest or the lagoon. <clears throat> Whichever you do. But I'm pretty sure Mene would have told us if there was no more pieces to be found here. I think the only gotcha moment is before the Hildegard. Think. Some pretty good uh, five second bonuses here. I'm just smashing through the dialogue, but um, if you find a treasure uh, within five seconds of having found the previous one, you get uh, ten extra points for that. So a very good combo would be to just like find, find like every item within five seconds of each other. Then you'll also have an amazing time, of course. Then it just mostly depends on the items, whether they give you lots, lots of points or not. Ooh, entrance. Right onto Mane. Weh. So I've been thinking about uh, what Final Fantasy game to play after 9. Um, which I mean, I suppose will possibly start next week. I mean, I'm also feeling like uh, playing, since we will be playing Tactics at least next week, um, maybe we'll play some other games and, and have a week off from starting a new Final Fantasy game. Um, oh, that was a quick one. Chocograph piece. Um, there we go. But yeah, um, I'll be thinking about what to start next, and I think it might be 13. We might just do 13. Which I've been vocal about being 
my least favorite Final Fantasy, but I want to also just like look at the good things about it because it, it has a lot of good stuff. Do you have all the Chocograph pieces? They make up one Chocograph now, Kupo. Take a look at what it says on the back. Go treasure hunting, Kupo. Choco said he already dug up all the Chocographs here. Kupo, maybe you can go to some other location by using dead pepper. Maybe. Maybe. Alright, so, uh, which one did we get now? Uh, Mist Ocean. That's the one. Look around the small islands located in the northeastern shore of the Mist Continent. Northeastern Mist Continent. I think it's pretty much like directly over over there. Um, oh, wait a minute. I'm, I'm going in the wrong direction. I'm just going to real quick speed this up a little bit. <laughs> Running through the ocean into the Mist Continent takes a while. Alright, here we go. Um... Is it this? Where? Where? Um, hold on. Uh, where? I guess not. It's these two then. No way, here we have the harbor. Uh, can I see the harbor in that? I mean, maybe? Where? Uh, between these? This is looking correct. Weh? 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 Cook, cook, weh! Found a treasure chest. Strange smoke appeared. Getting sleepy. Goodbye, blue, blue chocobo. Are we gonna get? Wanderer, we await your return. Yoko, you now have the ability to fly the boundless sky. You can take off and land in any forest. You now have all the abilities necessary to reach your homeland. We're a golden chocobo now. Oh yeah. So now we can just like go anywhere. We do need to get on land first to get to the forest. Give me a beach. Go. Um, I think we can technically do some... We can do Outer Island too. Uh, now. So let's go do that, because we are also pretty close to it. Oh! Nope, we won't do that, because we found... ...this, so... Get Pepper. <coughs> Chocobo's Air Garden. Choco can fly like me? Wow, that's great, Kupo. Hey. Did you notice, Kupo? This island is floating on clouds. The location of island might change when you go back down, so check its location on the map by pressing select. Ground is pretty firm. What a strange place, Kupo. You're the strange one, Mayne. <laughs> okay, okay, Zdane. Let's play hard and cold. Quah! Whoa, that was a <laughs> that was a quick one. <laughs> right at the start. Quah! So 
Chocobo's Air Garden is is terrible as a place to to uh, do hot and cold because of the two areas here that you need to jump between. If you're really lucky, you get like everything on one island, but most of the time you just have to jump between them. We did get pretty lucky with this one, though. But in this, it's, it's usually very important to just go back to where you were if you find a new Chocograph piece. Uh, or, or, I mean, a new piece of treasure. Because um, you don't want to waste time going to the other island just to discover that it was, after all, it was uh, on the island you started off on. Like, the good thing about uh, the air garden is that um, the areas to dig are pretty, pretty, like, small. So when you do find a hot spot, it'll be pretty easy to actually f dig it up. We got seven. That's, uh, that's surprisingly good. I mean, technically, if you do get, like, good... If, if you do find eight items in, in uh, Air Garden, you do get a lot of points. But I, I think, like, averaging it out, it's it's better to be in Lagoon. Where is this? Right here. Also, that area up there uh, where I was just now is one way where it's important to kind of go and pick it a few times from different spots because it can hide a hide an item in there quite well Weh. so we do have a few more chocographs to find here And then we can go hunt them down. Chocograph, there we go. And we also have one more dead pepper location to go to. I think we have two more chocographs. Dead pepper. At the very end of it all. Oof, another chocograph. Very nice, very nice. I mean, this whole place would be horrible if you had to dig in the clouds as well. Luckily, you can only dig on the firm ground here. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, tomorrow's uh, Final Fantasy... What the...? Uh, okay. I must have missed it. Um, tomorrow's Final Fantasy IX stream is gonna be late. I am... Um, oh! I did the mistake where I didn't check the spot where I... The whole whole island I was on. Yeah, so that's why you don't want to do it. But uh, tomorrow's Final Fantasy IX stream is going to be... I think uh, one or maybe two hours late. Um, because I... I am... Um, double scheduled stuff. So we'll start a little bit later. I do feel kind of confident that we might be able to just... I feel like we might be able to do it that we uh, finish the game tomorrow. And, um, like, if we just 
beeline it for the finish, yes. But um, <laughs> even like doing all the extra stuff, I think we might be able to finish it tomorrow. Um, if we make good progress today. And then we can play Tactics on Thursday and we'll be ready for the charity stream on Saturday. Meh. Bad luck on this one. Oof, got it just in time. A remedy. Choco's got a pretty powerful beak right now. Chokura, there we go. I think we now have all of them. So there really isn't too much reason to do more hot and cold other than for those items. For protect rings and uh, robe of boards. Did uh, Choco's beak level just become 69? I think it might have. Oh, I thought I saw, saw Choco getting it there, but oh well, time's up anyway. Choco said he already dug up all the Chocographs here. I think you're ready to go to the unmapped Chocobuff's Paradise. Choco wants to go too, Kupo. Try using the dead pepper. That's what I think. Thanks, Manny. Um, so in Choco... Uh, in, in the Choco Chocobo air, air Garden, we can also go in here and uh, inspect this uh, Eidolon cave, but uh, we're not going to do it right now. That is the super boss, and we are like level 23 or something. Um, I mean, you, you, can, you can beat it quite low leveled uh, if you're prepped correctly, but... Alright, so... Um, the desert palace is here, so it's this island then. Weh, 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 um, weh, weh, it's not this island? Okay, sorry. I mean, we need the fly ability for this, so it would not be that place. It is this one. Ah, yeah, yeah, it is this one. Weh. 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 Found a treasure chest. 11 sapphires, 1 circlet, 1 pumice piece. One Hildegard tree card. Very nice, very nice. Uh, what else? Then we can do Outer Island. Hoopo, it isn't a very big island. Wait, is this the one we were on just now? Hmm. Weh. Weh, yep. <laughs> it was the other one. Found a treasure chest. 21 amethysts, 16 garnets, 1 Genji armor, and 1 Ragnarok. That's a big sword. Um, Fairy Island and Forgotten Island. I mean, we're gonna go be going to Fairy Island. Uh, what a strange shape for an island, Kupo. Forgotten Island, so it's gonna be at the Forgotten Continent. And, um, 
because it is a brown island, we know that it's not one of those um, those leading towards the lagoon. Rather, it is right here. Um, quah, 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 um, quah, it isn't this one. Oh, it is. Just had to look in the mountain. Weh! There we go. Treasure chest. One ribbon, one rebirth ring, 13 amethysts, and one arc card. Spoilers! Um, and then Fairy Island. Which is a little bit of a hint. Weh. 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 I think this one is like on the mountain. Hmm. Like some of these you may have noticed I, I can like pinpoint exactly where it is, but some of them, no. I was pretty sure it was on the mountain. Hmm. There we go. Ah, the foot of the mountain. 33 potions, 15 anointments, one holy mitre, and one dark matter card. Hmm. All right, all right. All right, so now we have some good stuff and we also need to adventure out here. So let's first of all equip all the new stuff. Um, see if we have any new things to learn. Zane does not. Um, we only have one gold hairpin, so I'm gonna switch that off. Everybody's learning stuff here already. So Steiner now has Ragnarok, which teaches Shock and Thunder Slash. Knight Sword bearing divine inscriptions. Um, nope, Holy Biter does not help here. Don't get any new stuff there either. Huh. I mean, okay. We're not actually gonna equip any of that. Let's just save because this place can be kind of dangerous. Vile Island. Friendly fight. Nope. Yarns. Um, with this team, no. Oh, no, 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 wrong thing. No! With Steiner in, in, you know, that condition, I'm gonna get out of here. Luckily, missing. Hmm. 
virus powder. Oof. Not, not only virus, but je death as well. Uh, let's do life. Oh, we don't have Cura for Dagger. Raga, I suppose. And also Antidote. No way to vaccine. Try again. Friendly fight. Yes. The friendly yarn. Have you met the others? Well, who are we missing? Hold up. We're missing somebody. <laughs> I thought... Wait, 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 wait. Who are we missing? Um... Oh. Oh, I think we didn't do a uh, ladybug. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think we've done everybody else except for except for Ladybug. So we need to go and um We need to go to Condor Petit. That. My bad. Guess we are close by. We might as well go to the Black Mage Village and buy some uh, wrists then. I'm pretty sure we can also meet um, Ladybug in this big forest here, so... Do that. I'm glad to be back, but... The sun looks different to me somehow. Welcome. Um, I'm checking if there's anything else we're missing. Nope. Um, leather wrists. No, wait a minute. We need wrists, not leather. I just, I just wasted some money on those. We need. We need steepled hats and wrists. We need the steepled hats from, uh, or the wrists from Lindblom. I have failed. Let me check the black cat shop here. If we have anything new in here. I do not believe so. Nope. But yeah, we can cut and rope over there. Fight around here, then. If we can get to a fight. Nope. Well, at least we're gaining some AP from this. Looking for Ladybug. There we go. Forgot about one. Want some ore. I think it's two ore.
All right. Tell Yeti I said hello. Thanks. Yeah, I will. Shadowy coming in here. Chris got some AP. Shadow underscore <laughs> hello. is now hosting the stream. Hello, Shadowy. How you doing? Welcome in. Welcome in. How was uh? How was the rest of uh, Wild Arms there? Um. Shadowy was playing some Wild Arms XF. Uh, doing um. You were doing like a hey, wait a minute. That's Final Fantasy IX. That's what I'm playing. Whoa. <laughs> but yeah, Shadow is playing some uh, Wild Arms. Uh, I was I was watching when you were doing um when you were doing uh the stealth mission. <laughs> Koopa, wait a minute, that is Final Fantasy IX. Indeed. And this is Final Fantasy IX. Uh so welcome in. Um as you can as you might see from um a dagger's portrait if you play the game before, you know at what stage in the game we are. <laughs> We're just hunting down some uh, friendly monsters here right now before going to Ibsen's castle. Um, I had to grind so that my characters were fast enough to take tackle the stealth mission. Ah, I see, I see, I see. Stealth missions... Um... I mean, I guess this game also has a stealth mission with, with Sid. When you're playing as Frog Sid. Um, but like stealth missions, I think... I love stealth games. Let's start with that. But I think stealth missions in games that are not stealth games... Usually are just bad. Most of the time, they're just bad. <laughs> yeah, it was... it was Koopo. Very Koopo. Um, what was I? Oh yeah, we got so we got a lot of AP there. Um, but yeah, we're we're just going around uh, doing some side questing now since we just got the airship and everything. So, uh, we can we can do that. Wait a minute, did the day get anything? I don't think so. Um, just you know, catching up on some abilities, learning some new stuff. All the good, good things. Ooh, Steiner can go all the way to Genji armor now. Defense 45. That's quite, quite the, quite the upgrade there. Mm, Genji gloves are actually compared to Venetia shield. Genji gloves give a lot more evasion, but gauntlets actually give even more evasion. I think Genji gloves are like. Pretty, pretty, um, like balanced out of these. Gauntlets give elemental defense though, so that's pretty big. And huge evasion. But much, much smaller magic evasion. But because they do give the elemental defense, I, I think the gauntlets are overall probably the best. They give us speed plus one, which is not that great. But um, I think we'll go with that as Steiner's permanent choice. Then what can we do? Restore HP, sure, 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 sure. Even though I was talking about how I never used that. Uh, Dagger didn't have any robes to learn. Oh, we still have Shiva and Ifrit and everything. Um, but I'd like to get something actually which is a little bit more expensive. Oh, Puma's piece actually is pretty expensive, so we could go with that. I think we'll do the Puma's piece learn those things. Eiko could finally learn Fenrir. 
Okay, so now we're getting half MP and full life for Echo as well. That's very good. No hats. Soon and haste. Uh, let's see about equipping half MP also for Echo. Oh yeah, we have Guardian Marg, uh, which is kind of, you know, which is which is a good thing for Echo, uh, unique as well. Half MP is 11. What am I wasting? Oh, we have Auto Region. Yeah, yeah. Let's switch that to half MP, and then we can get Guardian Marg as well. Mm. Yeah, we'll go with that. Wait. I thought Dagger had half MP as well. I guess not. No, the, it is in here. It's just not equipped. Do we need chemist? Well, what else is it gonna be? Who's? Would be nice, but I don't have quite the quite the amount of uh, magic stones for that, though. All right, I think we're good. Yeah, so now we can go meet the friendly Jan. You need to first meet all the others. Uh, you can actually meet the other friendly monsters in whatever order you want. Um, it is most helpful to do it in the order that uh, you can meet them. Um, because they always give you, except for Garuda, um, because they always give you the item that you need to give to the next one. Um, so, you know, Garuda gives you diamond, um, Yeti gives you... We got a preemptive strike here, so let's go for it. Let's go, go hard. with everything um but yeah like you you get you always get the item that the next one is asking for from the previous one snort oh no steiner's out goodbye steiner mega flare For some reason, I've got like a pretty good recollection of what, what like happened in the first game I played of this, and I'm pretty sure I met Ghost as the first friendly monster. Float. The yarn counters with float, and. Uh, Oh, yeah, it is. I don't. I don't think it is vulnerable to Odin, but we can give it a try. Virus powder kills Echo. Flash. I think actually, yeah, um, I don't remember if Steiner being snorted means that we can continue if we get wiped out or not. So we're gonna flee if Zantuxuka doesn't hit. Yeah, we're gonna go in there. Miss. Snort on Dagger as well. Yeah, we are out of here. Comet Ono. Oh Oof. Well, we're gonna find out. Rebirth Flame! <laughs> Phoenix comes in. Phoenix in here to save the day. This is what makes uh, Echo one of the... Like, I, I love that in this game all of the characters have like very great strengths to them. There's, there's a reason to have every character in the, in the party. Just from like a gameplay perspective. Like, Echo's strength is the fact that you have, in addition to everything else, you have have access to Phoenix as a as a backup. Um, if you 
if you have Aiko in your party and you have, um, I think you just, I'm not sure if you need to have learned Phoenix or not, um, but it, it takes a chance of, I think it's your amount of Phoenix pinions, I think it's two thirds of your amount of Phoenix pinions in your inventory. Don't quote me on that, but I think it's two thirds, or it, it's, it's a fairly high number um, at the end of the day. That you can have there. Let's, uh, let's let's grab a regular old tent and let's make a save as well. But it's not at all unusual that when you have Aiko in your party, you can you can get a second try. Okay, friendly on, friendly on. Friend, please. Yes. Have you met the others? Yes, I have. Not? What? Okay, hold on now. We met Moo, we met Ghost, we met Ladybug. Wait, did we ever meet Yeti? I don't think we met Yeti. Well then, <laughs> this is this is getting ridiculous. Okay, well, let's go to Madame Sari then. I'm sorry. I thought we had already met all of them. I think it might be that we we simply didn't didn't uh, didn't go in here. Ah, it's ragtime mouse, because we were flying around on the chocobo so long. All right, quiz time. Pop quiz. Question number seven. Some moves are friendly and don't attack. True, false. True. Uh, true. Bonk. Correct! You get 3,000 gil. You got 100% correct. You're an expert. Thank you, thank you. Now give us the give us the Yeti fight. You can also meet Yeti actually at um, b b b between Gizem the Grotto and and um, Bamisha. But this place was closer, so I figured let's come over here. Now both of our healers are using useless weapons for physical attacks. Give me friendly. Nope. Hmm, does Stan have anything? Not really. Oh, we could use charge. Charge! 
charge failed. Thanks, Steiner. You are very helpful. Try it again. Charge! Charge failed. Mess it up again. Um, we don't need to be fighting these things. We need, we need Yeti. I'm trying to remember, is it Yeti? I'm pretty sure. Like looking at the looking at all the monsters, I think it might have been Yeti that we didn't fight. Because because we did fight Nymph. We fought Mu. We fought Ghost. Must be Yeti. It's gotta be Yeti. Dagger dealing 416 damage. Where did that come from? Oh yeah, so after Dagger, um, Dagger gets the haircut, you no longer get the whole uh, Dagger can't concentrate thing. So you know, there's about like two two dungeons where you might want to bench Dagger if, if you are, uh, unless you don't mind uh, the random failures do anything. Nope. You know what? We're just fighting some random enemies here, so let's uh, get a speed up here. These are so so below our level that <laughs> it's just smacking them here. So get some speed in here. There we go. All right, it was Yeti. Hello, Yeti. The two ore again. I, I, I was so sure that we had met Yeti already, though. But I mean, I suppose not. Thanks. You're welcome. Duraga haste, uh, something, something, Fenrir, something, 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 thing. Um, the Garnet only got uh, Duraga from that. Uh, I guess let's get healing rod for Cura. Um, Suna is still being learned. I could reflect no. There was nothing. Um, yeah, nothing there. Nothing there. Helmet gets upgraded to Genji helmet for HP plus twenty percent. Very nice for Steiner. Uh, we can switch off the blood sword. We have power break, magic break. Yeah, I guess we need to go through all of these. Oof, the Ragnarok is going to be so powerful though. Eighty-seven attack. That's insane. But I guess we'll go through Power Break and Magic Break first. Like, now now Steiner is on par with Zdane uh, with this damage, but then goes up to double, over double damage after this. Now, finally, we've been trying to get this Yana. 
quite a few times here. Um, yeah, I mean, people still have things to learn, though, so I'll keep this party. I'd, I'd love to switch Zidane out so that somebody else could get the AP, but meh. Unfortunately, can't take take the uh, main character out of the party just yet. Flee. By Yan. He was a friendly one. Friendly Yan. There we go. Now, finally, are you happy? I'll give you a diamond. If you're happy, give me a diamond. I will give you a diamond. Finally. Diamond. Thanks a lot. Now you can reach the round guy. Thank you. 50 AP. Everybody getting something. Rosetta Ring. Um, especially with uh, AP up, everybody's getting something there. Um, so Zidane only has auto life left to learn. And we can go for the... For the uh, Flame Saber. I mean, I'm just going to be using Magic Break. <laughs> I don't want to equip it. <laughs> I want to equip Ragnarok. Eh, let's go flame saber. Um, then auto haste and auto potion. Garnet can now now um, hold on to whale whisker. I mean, it's kind of um, tiger racket is one that you could basically give either dagger or. Echo based on based on the situation. Um, it is the best weapon for both of them. In terms of just raw damage. And because the weapons don't give you any like uh, they they give you some like uh, elemental boosts and, and such, but um, they don't give you any like magic skill or anything, so it doesn't really matter who has it. If you have both of them in the party. But now we have Hamelin, so we can learn Kuraga, Might, and Jewel. Very nice. Very nice. Um, white robe. We need to switch uh, white robe over. Oh, not a raid. It's Maka. Mocality is raiding the stream. Mocality. <laughs> Maka, how are you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Let's do a shout out in here. Person of internet. Uh, that's Kingdom Hearts. Why is, why is Goofy a character? Why? 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 Why is Goofy a thing? Um, last scene playing retro. What were we playing? <laughs> what kind of retro? Uh, what was going on? Mm, tell us about it. We're just playing some Final Fantasy IX here. We are um, doing some some uh, side questing here at the end of disc three, um, just to get everything kind of prepped up. Um, because we are trying to finish the game um, by Thursday. So that then on Saturday, we have a Final Fantasy IX um, charity stream. We're going to be doing a 12 hours charity stream of this game, a speed run of it from start to finish uh, in hopefully under 12 hours or so. Um, getting the Excalibur 2, uh, basically. 
So, so yeah, we're trying to just get through the game here, uh, getting all the stuff and, uh, you know, getting ready for that. Um, so hope to see you on Saturday as well. Um, still shows Kingdom Hearts, which was like half an, a year ago. Yeah, I mean, it just uh, picks a random clip from your channel. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> I was playing Tetris Attack and Kirby's Mean Bean Machine. What is Kirby's Mean Bean Machine? I mean, it's a Kirby game, but what is it? Let me let me Google that. Kirby's. Puyo Puyo, basically. Okay. I see. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Okay. Um, cool. <laughs> Hope you had fun with that. Um, but yeah, we just, uh, we just side questing in here. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was giving Eiko, um, the, the white robe for Holy. So Eiko gets all of the stuff, and now we, I guess we can give Garnet, uh, the light robe. Yep. Yep, yep. And then Pearl Rouge needs to be switched to something else. Let's see from down here. Um... Maybe the MP up? Actually, boost. Let's get boost. Uh, over to Echo as well. Otherwise, pretty good. Um, okay, so next thing for us to do would be, I guess we should go um, finish up Chocobo's the, the Chocobo quest and go to go to Choco's homeland. Get Choco back home. So we now have um, ultimate weapons for for a few characters already. Um, fun fact is that uh, you can. <laughs> Like, similar to how you can get Lord, uh, Robe of Lords on disc 1, you theoretically can also get the best weapon for Quina. <laughs> because it all, all requires just, um, just frogs. The crack crumbled and opened up a hole. Chocobo's Paradise. So this is Paradise, Koopo. Mayne, where did, when did you get here? Yeah. Koopo, I followed you because I thought you'd find this place soon. I'm speechless, Koopo. Hello, Quah. Quah. Quah to you too. Wee. This place has fun slides everywhere. Quah. You want to play a game? Quah. No? Hmm. It's showing the card thing, but... Quah doesn't want to play a game. Oh, yet. I actually remembered why. Seeker Choco, welcome. I am Fat Chocobo, the king of Chocobo's paradise. It would have been better if you'd come here without the help of humans, but they have taken good care of you. I've made it so they can understand our language while they are here. Weh. You who brought Choco here, Choco will stay here and start a new life with us. You should say your goodbyes now. Aw, goodbye, Choco. Good quah. I'm Mayne. I live here too, Koopo. Little one. Koopo? Only Chocobos can live here. 
No exceptions. No exceptions. Coco. Have you finished your goodbyes? Not yet, Kupo. Choco still needs to find more treasures, Kupo. Choco, were you not looking for peace and companionship? Are there things you must take care of? Kwe. Then come back when you finish what you must do. I'm going home, Kupo. I'll be waiting at the usual location, Kupo. Which is all three locations at the same time. Did you know that you can use a dead pepper to cra crumble cracked mountain walls? Use dead pepper where the ocean is foaming and you'll find a treasure. Wanna play cards? Let's play. We haven't played cards in a while. Uh, we got some new new cards here. So we got the Hildegard. Um, what else do we get? I think we got two Hildegard cards, actually. We have a lot of airships in here. Um, oh yeah, we got Dark Matter. Let's bring in Dark Matter. Let's bring Masamune. Blue Narcissus. Um... Odin. Ark's pretty good. Alexander is unfortunately not. Uh, Iron Man. Let's bring in Nova Dragon for some damage dealing. Seems like a pretty regular deck here though. Um, we're not too good defensively. Uh, let's place Blue Narcissus here and hope for the best. Um, uh, Odin to the fight, I guess. Always gotta be fighting. Win. Yeah, pretty bad cards here. Uh, I don't really care which one I take. Goodbye. You didn't have any good cards on you. Walk, quack, quen, quack, quack. I heard the mountain on C on Seaton's ice field on the lost continent has crack in it. So here uh, you can talk to the different chocobos and get hints about those uh, dead pepper locations. Um, and also, this place is just quite nice. <laughs> you get to ride some slides. Oh, should have jumped off there. <clears throat> Up. Hippity hop. Like, I like how some of these have, have absolutely no, like, actual purpose. It's just for you to have fun here. With Joko. The east side of the mountain on Seaways Canyon on the Forgotten Continent has crack in it. Do you have any good cards? about the same. Uh, let's get one of these. Let's get Lee and Bloom to defend. The moon, eh? Let's do... Let's do Ark. Uh, Lee and Bloom can't actually attack anything over there. Hmm. It's a bad... Bad map for Lee and Bloom. I want to fight. I want to fight. There we go. I'll drop a Masamune up here. Oh, Ark lost that one. Woof. 
Alright, we got a perfect on this, so we get some trash cards. I guess Dragonfly was actually new. Thanks a lot, friend. But the big thing is to fight against Pat Chocobo. You want all the d dead pepper I own? Yes. I already have enough. Fine. Uh, some of the treasures were hidden long, long ago. They're hard to find, even with the dead pepper. His beak can crack open stone walls. He can jump into the ocean and fly high into sky. Use these abilities and seek out the treasures. I'll wait here for your return. This is once taught me how to play. I do believe there's only one more... Um, one more dead pepper item left in the game. If I'm not mistaken. I think we got all of the others. But that one we can't get until uh, disc... Um, this tree. So Fat Chocobo fights with Chocobo cards. Because why not? Ooh, pretty good. But Ramu comes in here and steals. Ah, I didn't get a full stock of Chocobo cards. Um, now we get this one. Chocobo isn't too good of a card. Not too good. Uh, all right, but that's basically what we came in here for, for the Chocobo card. So that's my sub. Hello, Wrathful Prism. Welcome in. So let's head on out then. What's up next then? I guess we could go to... Oh yeah, let's go to Taguero. Um, no, let's go, let's make a little bit of money first. Let's go and do the, uh, do a quick run of money here. I'm going to speed it up for this. So we're just going to go to Lean Bloom and buy some wrists and then go to Black Mage Village and uh, turn that into money. I think one unfortunate thing about the game, which I want to mention now, is that, because I want to... I want to enjoy uh, the world, ma world map music for as long as we have it, uh, because we are not going to be having it for much longer, unfortunately. Wait a minute. Hold on. Aren't they supposed to be selling wrists? No, I'm silly, of course. No, 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 it's Dali. Why, why, why was I thinking about Lindblom? Probably because it's Linbloom, like, regularly. Before this point, you use Linbloom. But of course, no, 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 no. You go to Dali for the wrist. Why would they be selling um, wrists in Linbloom? I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, where's Dali? Uh, right here. Duh. I did a dumb... Yeah, this is... Oh, we already... Maybe I should have checked the fact that we already had 99 wrists. Oof. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, but let's let's do a run of this at least. At least one uh, before we go to Daguero. Um, go and... Synthesize this into cotton robes. So now we can just do as many as we want. I, I'm pretty sure... Um, we are already, we have already learned everything there is to learn about, learn from the cotton robes, so we can sell all of them anyway. Um. But I do like to have just like, you know, uh, an amount of things in. In our inventory. It's also like, okay, cotton robes is not an example of it, but um, like some items, some low level items you might want because of them, like absorbing a particular element or something like that. Alright, so yeah, 
So, so yeah, at, at this point in the game, you can go between um, you can go between Dali and the Black Mage Village, and just make infinite amounts of money uh, using the cotton robe trick. If you don't want to do that, you can always just fight enemies <laughs> and make the money that way. That works as well. I mean, we could be doing some uh, some power leveling here as well. Let's go to Daguerre first, though. Am I available to able to play Satisfactory later? Um, not today, no. Hello? Hello? Oh yeah, we need to first activate it. Daguerre has a uh, really great music here in the background. Daguerre was built by some strange scientist. To get around this place, you'll have to use the lift, which are powered by water pressure. Zidane, my goodness, how wonderful to see you again. Hey, what are you doing here? After Clara was destroyed, I realized how isolated we have all been. So I decided to broaden my horizons and came here. It's wonderful here. I am constantly learning something new from these books. Someday, I hope to contribute to the restoration of Clara. Okay. Um, left lever. Left. What's this bar doing here? Oh, wait a minute, actually, uh, middle. I want to talk to, talk to you first. Quiet, can't you see I'm doing research here? Okay, fine. Uh, left lever. Oh, we need to first look at the hole. What is this hole? Hey, maybe I can fit this in that hole. Let's see if this will fit. Perfect. Right lever. Great. Great puzzle. Alright, the lift works now. Thanks a lot, man. So we can be mage mashers, clay dissolving blade, a rune blade, that's a new one. Arbalisk is a new one. Tiger Fangs is new? And I'm pretty sure we already had Tiger Fangs equipped. Um, I'm just buying like two of each here. Defense gloves is actually new. We can buy some gold hairpins here, very nice. Coronets. Diamond helms. Demon's vests. Oh, running low on money now. Oof. And diamond armor. Well, that's everything. Um, yeah, we need, we need to make some money, actually. This is a reading room. In addition to tables and chairs, we also have hammocks for people who, fo who fall asleep while they are reading. I'd like to stay here for 100 gil. No. A good book lasts forever. It will always be there, in your memories. I've asked to be buried with my favorite book. Uh... Okay. I can't find the idol on an eye. I've looked everywhere. Press the button. E. Sounds like something just happened below. No, 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 no. That's just what on, what's on the... Hold on. Can I help you? Um, nothing interesting in the item shop. We're having a debate right now. In I want to be your cannery, why do you think Cornelia had to die? That was the only way she could be united with Marcus in death. 
No, it was to prove that she loved Marcus just as much as she loved her father. What do you think? She died to be united with Marcus, she died to prove that she loved them both. Hehehe, <laughs> I told you. I came here to research a new source of power. Some of the systems here are rather complicated. The source of all this water is a mystery as well. It really is the work of, a, of the Dragon Guard. Jeez, there are all, all kinds of books here. Bell Echoes, Beyond the Mist, Mist Engine Illustrated, The Eidolon and I, Gaia, Book of Magic. Found your book? I can't find the Eidolon and I, I've looked everywhere. I saw that book over there. Oh really, thank you. <laughs> this ladder feels kind of damp. Go down. <laughs> the damp ladder. Who doesn't love a damp ladder? I love books, especially the old ones. I appreciate everything about them. The authors, the publishers, the readers. I'm doing research on a leg legendary man. He had the power to restart people's lives. Hey, that's the Namingway card. Let me see it. I won't take it or anything. Yep. Oh yes! I'm stoked with imagination. I'm inspired to create. I've just mastered the Namingway technique. Now let me rename one of you. Whose name do you want to change? No. Thanks, though. Uh, so... <laughs> you can actually do, like, a Namingway thing here. Um, so you can change, change people's names if you want. I mean, actually... I don't know. Should we just rename, um... We could rename Dagger back to Garnet now, you know? Yeah, why not? Garnet. <laughs> it's, it's, um, not gonna be too confusing anymore. Geez, so many books, what should I read first? Because everybody will basically refer to... Ah, I don't know. Nah, I'm gonna switch it back. Because cause people are still gonna be referring to Garnet as Dagger. Ah. There we go. Could be Dagger too as well. Return to the second floor. I enjoyed my life here being surrounded by all these books, but sometimes it takes forever to find the book I want to read. Theories of the underground world often refer to the fact that Gaia has two moons. Some studies suggest that the orbital axis of the two moons are shifting. This is Daguero, where knowledge and water come together. What do you need? We can get Sagatanas saga, 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 saga in here. We can also do cotton robes in here. Silk robes, magician robes, glutton robe. That's a new one. Um, we can get white robes and black robes done here as well. Um, anything else interesting? Um, we can make some more promise rings if we wanted. Battle boots are a new thing. Uh, we can make more rebirth rings. More agely rings. We can make more, um, more of any of these gems, which is very nice. A thief gloves. Hmm. Okay. So, I think we might want to just do Nogi. Can I help you, Kupo? We might want to just do some money, money, uh, laundering here with cotton robes. I haven't received any mail lately, Kupo. All right, Nogi. And who do we have in here? You came here hoping to find find some treasures, uh huh? I can tell you from I can tell from your eyes. I'm a treasure hunter myself, and a famous one too. Just because I'm famous doesn't mean I'm gonna tell you my name. Almost all treasure hunters are assigned ranks. I, of course, have attained the highest rank. Let's see. Your treasure hunter rank is 
No way. You're rank S? No way. We're rank S already? What the? But pardon me for my rudeness. What is with that guy? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't realize we were already rank S. Well then. That's easy. <laughs> easy. Huh? What's this? Capricorn. Um. Hey, I'm sorry for talking big earlier. Be honest, I'm not famous or anything. I'm just a loser rank D treasure hunter. But someday I'm gonna become a rank S treasure hunter like yourself. I just want to become stronger, you know? So no one will pu push me around and call me forearms anymore. Received rank S medal. Take care. Oh yeah. I haven't told you my name yet. My name is Gilgamesh. I'm gonna be famous one day, so don't you forget it. Take care. Oh, it was Gilgamesh all along. Also, did you see the red mage who was just... just uh, vibing over here and then disappeared? Huh? What is this? That's just like walking into nothingness. Adventurer, there's an old legend in this region about a dragon god and his divine protection. I think it might be true. I mean, look at this place. We're surrounded by mountains in the middle of nowhere, and the water here never runs out. It has to be the work of the dragon god. Let's see. Dragon god's blessing to the stone. So I'm supposed to put a stone here. Stone. Maybe some ore might work. I like 50. They transformed. Acquired 12 Aquamarine. Cool. Um, so yeah, we need to get some money. But actually, let's check out this. Uh, so, so I, I wasn't expecting us to have access to Rankis Metal just yet. Uh, we have some other items as well. Rat Tail. I almost ate this thing when I first found found it. I thought it was a snack. Gwahaha, <laughs> Baku. Uh, watching the sunset from the cape, Virgo whispered, My only wish is to be with you. Sagittarius? Sagittarius dashed through the night, defying the chilly northern wind that was stinging his right cheek. Capricorn? Impatient Capricorn ran up a hill toward the sun and fell asleep from exhaustion. Um, Chocograph piece is here. Uh, the first one was, There, danger in the sky, if you dare... To face it, use this wreck to find your way. Uh, those who do not fear death, find one of the islands in salvage. See what lies there. Courageous one, head south, east on the outer continent to reach Quentis Peninsula. See what lies there. Noble one, head northeast, the mist continent to reach Alexandria Plains. See what lies there. Dreamer, head to the ocean in the center, all continents, see what awaits there. Cautious one, head to the east of of, bar, of something ca canyon on the forgotten continent, sea waste canyon on the forgotten continent, see what lies there. Um, these are, I, I, I think these are the um, locations for the, for the air garden where it can appear. Rank S Medal. The owner of this medal is certified as a Rank S Treasure Hunter by the Treasure Hunter Guild. TH Guild. So I don't know why Gilgamesh has the Rank S Medal to give to us. <laughs> being a being a Rank D. Um, was it possible to just like unequip? I don't think so. Oh, cancel. There we go. That under unequips the choke graph because we already found all of them. Okay, so let's um let's start off then by going to Treno to uh, take those take those um those Stellatio coins in there. We might get a little bit of money to use for making money with. Um, 
with the cotton robe. We're also going to need some money to play the auction house a little bit more. Capricorn. Black Belt. Sagittarius. Hmm. My nose is itchy again. Give me money. 20,000 gil. Thank you. Virgo. Rosetta Ring. All interested in collecting Salazios. How many do we have? We got um, five on the left side and and five on the right side as well. So we are missing two more. Try to remember where they are. So now we're going to go back to Dali to buy the wrists, and then we can go to the Black Mage Village and make some money. We need to do this trip a few times to have enough for the thief gloves and everything. Wrists. Gonna need to get a little bit of like seed money here first. Um, I think it's probably best to do this with Choco because Choco can just like land next to the Black Mage Village. I think I'll sell some of the um, leather wrists that I accidentally bought. Um, wait, wrists. Here we go. Leather wrists. Like that. And then we need steepled hats. While leaving enough money for uh, some cotton robes as well. then sell over here. I should make it so that uh, the cotton ropes actually become uh, or add are added to the top. Hold on. Items. Arrange automatically and then throw the potions down here. Oh wait, we need we need to actually switch the potions with the cotton ropes. Range, manual, potion, and robe. And I can just go for them faster here. You make pretty good money this way. We need some more steepled hats. Pretty fast to do it. Uh, no, I don't, I don't need to sell. I need to buy steepled hats. robes and sell and buy and sell and buy and sell. Oh, now the steeple hats are there. In, uh, oh, the cotton robes must be down here. And, yep, here they are. Oh, sin! We got more people coming in here. More raiders. It's been a it's been a raidy night. Is now hosting the stream. <laughs> Sinachish. Hello, hello, Sin. Let's do... Oh, almost, almost started raiding you. 
Uh, no, let's do a shout out to Sin. <laughs> Playing some Spooderman. That is, I would guess that's. Oh, that was Genshin Impact. I, w I was gonna say uh, from the loading screen, I, I thought that uh, that looked like it could have been uh, Breath of the Wild, some sort of loading screen from that, but it being um, Genshin Impact, I guess, pretty much the same game, right? <laughs> but welcome in Sin. How was your stream? How was your How was your Spider Man's? Um, have you been enjoying the game? Uh, I've I've like watched some some uh, playthroughs of it. I I haven't actually actually played um, Spider Man myself, but it's it looks it looks fun. The last Spider Man game I played, I think, is Spider Man uh, for the PS2. Which one was it? I think it's Spider Man Two, the 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 one that everyone knows. Um, I think it's Spider Man Two for, for the PlayStation Two. But anyways, um, I hope you had fun. We have Cerulean here, of, of course, as well. Hello, Cerulean. Welcome back. Um, yeah, we're just playing some Final Fantasy IX's here. Uh, we're currently we are just doing a, doing a um, exploit to get some money. Um, <laughs> we are trying to get through the game here. Um, hopefully by this, or, or we will we will get through the game this week because on Saturday we're gonna have to do. Um, we, we have a charity stream, so we'll be doing 12 hours of Final Fantasy IX, uh, speedrunning the whole game from, from uh, beginning, beginning to end uh, in 12-ish hours. So, trying to finish the game before we need to finish the game again on Saturday. Um, love it. I played it when it first came. Oh, I, I, I must get ready for work, though. I must re, re Kupo for Kupo, though, Synth one wave. Spot, spot, yes. Um, but thank you for the raid, though. And uh, also Cerulean, good looks, good looks. Um, but yeah, we're, we're just making some monies here. I need to... I need to rearrange these again. Buy the robes. We need to buy some more wrists now, so we should go for that. We need to range these. I mean, I guess the sepal hats can be up here, so that because we'll, we'll be using them anyway. Um, so I'll just be like messing this whole thing up here. Wait, it's cotton robes right there. What the? No, cotton robes at the top. What? It's it's arranging the thing that is next to it right now. Okay. Well, I'm just going to I'm just going to question it. It's being weird, but don't question it. So we need to hop over to Dali again. Which is right here. Wait a minute. There was a thing to interact with here. Moving too fast. Oh! Apparently we've missed 120 gil in that corner. Well, we already have S rank for the for the treasure hunter, so who cares? I am already a master treasure hunterist, so I don't need to prove any anything to anyone. Alright, got the wrist, so back to the Black Mage Village. Um, we have some cotton robes, so I'll just sell those off right away. And uh, I guess buy some more steepled hats. We can get 99s on both. Oh, before we do that, uh, let me just rearrange again. So the wrists are also... No, I pressed auto. Okay, well. Get the cotton robes on top. Then bring in the steepled hats as the second item, and then the third item is gonna be wrist. There we go. 
so now the cotton robes will always be on top. Or at least, like, close to the top here. And buy a bunch of steepled hats. Like, the... The thieves' gloves themselves are already... Would now take all of our money. It's 50k for one, one of those. So we definitely want to have some money here. Be able to buy this stuff. We are almost at the point now where we'll be able to... Like, on the next next trip to Dali, we'll be able to now just buy out the full amount of cotton robes with our money. And sell it off. Like that. I'm gonna say let's do maybe two more trips to Dali. Uh, it's not gonna take that long. Especially now that we don't need to like go between two places to to buy buy more to sell more to buy more to sell more. We can just do the full batch. I do like um I do like that they never um fix this. Like, I'm pretty sure it's most likely that this was a mistake by the devs. They didn't mean there to be a way to make infinite money by just buying and selling stuff. Um, but they must have just... It must have just been an oversight with the cotton robes. The way you can make money back with them. But I mean, oh, nope, no, 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 no fight, no fight. There we go. Um, but yeah, they. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad they didn't fix it, because because it's something I feel like that it could have been pretty easy for them to fix in like uh, the Steam release or something like that. It was nice to have some sort of a way for easy money is. You can always, if you want, you can always do it the hard way. But I've done it the hard way enough times that I'll, I'll just, I'll just take the easy way out now. Um, definitely. You know, let's do one more trip to Dali. Why not? Once more. It is fast enough. And I don't want to have to come back here, uh, do this again right away. As far as I know, the cotton robe is the only thing that you can synthesize for a profit. Um, I don't think there's anything else. And it makes sense because it is, you know, it's a, it's a very early, early combo. So also the pieces that make it come very cheap. There we go, 330, 300, uh, 300,000 uh, gil in no time whatsoever. So now we can go back to Daguero and uh, buy some some of that stuff. Um, and after that, what else should we do? I mean, we should go to Ibsen's castle soon. 
Um, but we could do some... Uh... Hmm. Okay, I gotta take the speed off to be able to get anywhere in here. Um... Love dance. Um... There's, there's too many things to do. Get a sag, Sagatanas. Two, actually, we're gonna need two of those. Um, Glutton's robe requires... Oh, no! <laughs> Glutton's robe requires cotton robes. Okay, we're gonna do it one more time. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Let me just equip the Sagatanas now. Uh, doesn't give anything new. It it does teach Annoy, as I was uh, wondering about earlier. Um, I thought so. Okay, so off to Dali one more time. Once more unto Dali. Oop. Rip Clara. Let me in. Nope. I don't want to talk to you. Wrist. But you know, like, I, I I, so love the way the, 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 like, item system in this game works. It's so, like, satisfying to just learn, learn all these new items and abilities and everything. And it does really make, like, all, all the items feel like they have a place. Well, not all of them, <laughs> but most of them have like a place in the game. Steeple to hats. And then you have the whole synthesis thing, which might like bite you in, an, in a first playthrough where you don't think of buying certain things in bulk and then you can't synthesize stuff. So we'll make a full pack of... Oh, well, we already made a full pack of those. Uh, I'm gonna sell... Uh, where are the cotton robes now, then? Cotton robes? Here we go. I'll sell off... I'll leave ten. There we go. And one more time. Speed down. And let's synthesize. Aguero is, um... Pretty much like the second best synthesis shop in the game. Uh, so Glutton's Robe, I, I think at this point we only need to maybe make one of each. Mm. I made two, just in case. <laughs> um, we could make an extra white robe, extra black robe. Yeah, it's just Gaia gear and some, some armlets. Kakus just don't need to be made more. No, 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 Pearl Rouge is one that is kind of a, kind of a, um, trap, because you don't want to make you don't want to make this because moonstones. First of all, you can get pearl rouges from the auction house. It costs a lot more, but the thing is that moonstones are limited in the game, so you don't want to do this. Uh, promised rings. I don't know if we need another promised ring. It just gives them uh, some bonuses to damage. Let's get some battle boots. Two battle boots. Um, Rebirth Ring is also another one. You're using Diamond, and I, I do believe Diamonds are also 
Um, also something that you can't make more of. We already have angel earrings. They raise holy. Eh, I'll just, we'll, we'll just have the one. But then, thief gloves. We'll just make one of those for now. Um, and that should give Zdane Master Thief. Gloves used by thieves. They give quite a nice evasion bonus. Less magic evasion than the Egoist Armlet. And the Egoist Armlet also protects from, from shadow, so um, I think it's probably preferable. Uh, the Thief Gloves gives you the plus one speed, but again, speed unfortunately not so great in this game. Uh, do we have anything else? No. And wait a minute. Uh, oh yeah, we have the battle boots. So battle boots give MP attack initiative and HP plus 20. So nothing new actually from that. Let's see, I'm feeling like Zidane might actually have a full set now. Is there anything that we are missing? So Master Thief, um, if I remember correctly, Master Thief is... I think it's Final Fantasy IX where um, Master Thief is something you don't want to equip. No, wait. Is it? I'm not sure. In, in some games, the whole, like, still better, rarer items thing is broken in that you actually won't be able to get rarer items. I think, yeah, yeah, I think it's actually that in this game it actually um, kind of breaks sometimes and makes, makes rarer items harder to steal than the than the others. And we are missing one thing. What comes after Protect Girls? I don't remember. But we have one one thing here that Zidane can still learn. But otherwise, we have almost every ability. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I absolutely forgot about, like, what we actually bought. Diamond armor was one. Yeah, yeah. But uh, Genji is better than diamonds. Uh, no new robes that we can use here. Nothing new there. Okay, I think nothing, nothing really in particular right now. So, um... Did I say what I thought we were gonna do next? Because I don't remember if I said... If I had an idea about what to do next. Um... So we're done the Chocobo stuff. We're done with everything Chocobo related. Except for the one dead pepper treasure on in the next disc. Um, we took the Stellatios back. Uh, the auction house. We should probably check that. Don't remember exactly if there's anything in particular us to get from there right now but we might as well go check and um, we could just like generally get some get some leveling done or something um, I might want to look at look at some sort of like list of side quests, just in case taking a long way around. Oh, 
Oh, I think we might actually have a new new enemy to fight here as well. We can then send Zidane down to fight somebody here in the house. Yep. Nope, don't buy still. Uh, fight the monster. Let's see if Zidane can just like... Just do it. Hello there. What is your name? Oh, I have no MP. Well, no MP attacks then. I'm Ducius. Bonk. Ooh, not that much damage. Hmm. I'm considering having Zane use an elixir here. Well, Bio's not doing too much. But it does do poison, which isn't nice. Clean that up. Level 4 holy. Um, I don't think that's gonna hit. Yep. Um, I would actually want to, yeah, I, I wanna do an elixir, but let's take a few hits. Because we might be trancing in this fight. By the looks of it. Another bio. Yeah, another good hit and we're... Oh! Just double spell? Oh yeah, we are in trance. So should have had the, the elixir already. Because I can't dine now. Bonk. We can do an elixir though. We have enough trance left. Elixir? You know me, don't you like using elixirs on anything, but I think in this situation we can do it. Full health, full MP. Oh, you're flying now. That's fine. Grand lethal. Full nines, and it's dead. <clears throat> wow, I can't believe it. Here's your prize. Running shoes, thanks very much. Definitely needed those. We definitely haven't had a lot of those already. Alright, what do we have in here then? Today's items. Magician robe, fairy earring, medallion string, thief gloves. <clears throat> well then, let's buy the thief gloves, I suppose. So we have two, so Amaranth can get get a pair as well. Fairy earrings, nah. We have plenty of those. We got plenty of medallion strings as well. Thief gloves. Ready three K. Meh. Pretty good considering it costs fifty K to to synthesize. I don't think they are selling anything else new then. No. It's just the same ones. Magician Robe, Fairy Ring, Med Medallion String and Pearl Rouge. Nothing else new. Alright, um... You know... Yeah, let, let's take a quick break here, stretch break and such, and uh, I'm just gonna check out a side quest list just so... Just to remind myself so I don't forget about any particular side quest we could be doing. Um, so yeah. 
let's take a quick break thank you everyone for joining in so far on the final fantasy 9 goodness and uh we'll continue on after this maybe we'll continue the main quest maybe we'll side quest who knows you just have to wait to find out we have
All right. So actually, I, I um, looked up the list and uh, yes, there is actually nothing we can do right now. Um, well, I mean, there's there's more things that we could do, but uh, nothing like like we can collect more frogs for Queen and stuff like that. But um, otherwise, not really anything uh, we could do. Uh, we basically we need to just finish the game. No, no, finish, finish the disc, finish the disc, finish disc three, and then we can do some more side questing on disc four. Um, so we're gonna be main questing around. So let's head on to Ibsen's castle then. Um, wandering. Sure, let's go with this team. I like that uh, Zidane's model basically stays in, stays mostly in place here while flying. There's a Choco lapping around. <laughs> so we don't need the Hildegard. We don't need to actually bring the airship in here. We can just Chocobo over. We could already reach this place with Chocobo. Um, first time we were around here. Ibsen's castle. Is this the old castle Hilda told us about? What a strange looking place. Like it's upside down or something. Alright. I'll take three of you with me. The rest of you, s you secure this spot. Hey, today. What's up, Amarant? I work alone. Always have. Always will. I don't know why you bother carrying dead weight all the time. What's your point? I'm saying working alone beats working in a team any day, and I'm gonna prove it. Hilda said there's some key here to break the seal, am I right? Yeah. Let's see who finds it first. I'll be going by myself, of course. Amarant, you selfish, ignorant fool. Calm down, Rusty. But... What should I do? Let him go. Okay. I don't know what you're thinking, but if that's what you want, it's okay by me. Well, aren't you an agreeable fellow? Well, see you later. Are you sure about this, Zidane? What can I do? I can't change the way he thinks. Let's get going, everyone. We'll beat Amarant at his own game. We lost Amarant. Um, yeah, Echo Steiner, Dagger, sure. Ibsen's castle. So, let's equip uh, the worst weapons we can. Um, I guess Echo will hold on to the Hamelin. Um, I mean, I would also want... Uh, I want to learn these things. I want to hold on to the Flame Saber. The Dagger can come in with a rod. So I guess we'll have Dagger and uh, Zidane as our physical specialists here. Warriors. One of the Salatios. And then there will be one more. So there we have a dagger, which is the first indication about, like, what's, what's up with this place. Do not be restricted by your knowledge and experience. This place turns logic upside down. What's big is small, what's strong is weak, and heaven is earth. That also giving you a little bit of a tip. Most likely when you come in here you will have your best stuff equipped and everything. Then you go up against something like this and attack it and then you you notice that your, your attacks are doing absolutely nothing.
Bonk. Yeah, Sina's not doing much anything with the flame saber. Echo doesn't do too much either. But but uh, Dagger and Zidane do quite a lot of damage here. So they can act as our physical fighters. Oh! Blasted. Let's do a stoner. Wait a minute, this top. Uh, a sooner. Um, I don't know if Steiner has in particular any abilities right now which could help do anything else. Yeah, not really. Steiner's kind of dead weight right now, as long as we're learning the abilities. I mean, Steiner learns chemist though, right? Oh! As soon as it doesn't stop, stop. Okay. Um, we should do a heal in here. Oh, let's do a big Kyuraga. Blaster. No, don't blast Dagger. Oof. You wanna just run from this, I guess? Possibly. Echo can use Holy. Okay. That, that, that worked. I wasn't expecting it to do all that much damage, but it did. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I mean, no, we're gonna hold Steiner on to the flame saber and learn abilities. Kamul, Morganet, give Kamul a letter. A letter, Kupo. How unusual! I'm so happy, Kupo. From Moggy to Kamul. Hey, Kamul. How are you, Kupo? Our smuggles in Lindblum are all wondering the same thing these days. Where the heck is Mognet Central? No one knows, Kupo. Do you know where it is, Kumul? It's supposedly very far away, and you can't enter very easily, Kupo. I heard that you can't enter Mognet Central unless you're riding on a chocobo, Kupo. I'll give you this in exchange for delivery. Received, Kupo, not. Thank you. Uh, I haven't received any mail lately, Kupo. Right, what's in your mug shop? Ah, here, here you can, in, in this mug shop, you can buy, um, like, level second tier weapons as another hint towards what's going on so basically um, the lower your attack the more damage you deal in this place as opposed to how it usually works cat's claws There. Nothing around either. <laughs> Can't go up. I don't feel like there's any treasures around here. Yeah, nothing. Ooh, except death. Let's fight. We have a stoned enemy. Gargoyle. And a gear is. Oh, hitting decent damage. Miss. 
Hold on, do we need to actually use a use a self? I'm not sure if that actually works. Let's see. Rise! Well, too late. Bio. And they're not doing too much damage here. Um, freeze. I don't have body temp. Dagger's gonna freeze. I was gonna try to do a uh, charge here. Aerial slash. Oh no, I think this is gonna hit everybody. Yep, dagger died. Let's do full life. Nice. Got a charge in there. Break. Come on. Not. Not Ico. Give me another soft. Hopefully it doesn't use its aerial slash again. That thing hurts. Gradual Petrify. I'll take that. Basically a wasted turn from it. Zay is doing MP attack, which I don't... I don't know how to actually... How MP attack works in Ibsen's castle. It might either be good or bad. <laughs> Surprise. Either it's a good thing or it's a bad thing. I'm guessing it's probably a good thing even here. At least we're getting some good good uh, level ups in here, which is nice. Probably do a heal. Uh, let's go down first. Nope, we should have gone up first. Uh, to the left. We of course have have this um Javelin. This uh, same same music as in Oil of Earth. I don't think we can do anything by going up here either in this view. Gotta go down and then back up. Be able to Jump right again. Broadsword. Most of the treasure chests in this um, in this place are just uh, the initial weapons of everybody. Because it would actually be quite mean for the game. Uh, oh, no, we're go no going there. Quite mean for the game to be doing this sort of um, thing uh, without actually giving you access to to those uh, weapons, just surprising you with you know your weakest weapon is your strongest weapon, and then somebody who might be playing this, you know, selling all of their newest, all of the old weapons when they get a new one. Not good. 
Not a good combo there. Oh no. Oh boy. Marine, please. Bahamut, please. Please. Got some ton bows in here. Please? Save me from the Tonberries. I realize we don't actually have any MP recovery in this team here, so we'll just have to go with whatever we, we um, some um, ethers, I suppose. Uh, let's bring in Fenrir as well, we just gotta like hit them with some heavy stuff. Short animation Mega Flare, still does pretty good damage. Bonk into each other. I don't usually remember there being several Bonberries in in one game or in, in one like battle. Everyone's grudge. One. <laughs> You suck, Tonberries. Terrestrial Rage. Oh yeah, and of course, the, the other thing I just re remembered looking at Echo's transmitter. The other thing that like differentiates Echo and Dagger from each other and gives them their like specialization is the fact that Echo's trans is double white, hitting for a white mage, and Dagger's is Eidolon, hitting for a summoning expert. level ups and we get auto potion for Steiner as well um, which is actually like it's interesting that dagger is the more, more powerful more powerful summoner but um, I suppose like part of it could be that the, this the, the game mentions several times like you know with extraction of the Eidolons you need to be like 16 and um, you need to be 16 to leave the village and all of that so, you know, it could just be that because Dagger is older, that's where the power comes from. But it is strange because Dagger doesn't have the Summoner's Horn, for example. This is strange. Examine. Examine. Push. Pound. Think. Think. No, I think it's pound again. Pound. Push. Try something drastic. Rest. Whoa, what the? Barret? Don't think there was anything else on this.
Exclamation mark. You're late today, and I'm the winner. See how much time you lose by working with others. Have you figured out how to break the seal? Take a look at that wall. Maybe you can figure it out. But it's no longer my concern. What do you mean? Proved myself right. I don't need to follow you around anymore. We may be enemies next time we meet. See ya. See ya? Ugh, who does he think he is? It's his way. We can't challenge him. Change him. Let's get going. Mm. Ether on Zidane as well. Let's see. There's something written on it. My power is protected behind a tornado. Received wind mirror. Let's see. This one too. My power is protected underwater, surrounded by the earth. Water mirror. Let's see. And this one. My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. Received fire mirror. Let's see. That means this one too. My power is protected under the shaking ground. Received earth mirror. Key items. Earth mirror. Mirrors is the only way I can describe these items. They each have their own elemental attribute. There is writing on the back. What does it mean? Terrace Chronicles. Water mirror. I've linked these items with the artifact, but I'm not entirely sure about it. The only conclusion I've reached so far is that they are not of this world. Fire mirror. I learned that they hold terrifying powers. How were their powers used? Perhaps it was used to seal some other great power. The mirrors were lost, ending my research. All facts about their origins have vanished. All I've learned is what I know very little. That I know very little. Well, looks like we got what we came here for. Let's go. What did it say, Zane? Yeah, they were the same as the ones I saw at Allvot. Like Hilda said, those things on the wall must have something to do with the seal. Let's think about that later. We need to get out. Mira, return to me. Who's there? Energy flow interrupted energy to Terra. Who dare get in the way of Terra's master plan? Oh, what is this? What is this? My name is Taharka. Turn my mirrors. You should say please when you ask for things. Fool, you'll regret this. Also, I didn't ask your name. Post times. Steel. Stolen elixir. You can actually do a scan here. Let me actually do a detect on it. Oh, wait a minute, this is a boss. What am I thinking? Attack. Let's do a little bit of damage to it. Oricalcan. Uh, Mithril Claws. Eh, Oricalcan I'll want. Mithril Claws. Meh. Compact. Protect against physical damage. Couldn't steal. Let's keep everybody alive and uh, do some steals here. Um, I mean, we could technically do some like offensive stuff. I don't know if it's really worth it. Couldn't steal. I don't remember if Tahaka does any spells though. 
So thinking, oh, well, no, we don't have anybody, uh, none of the healers have um, Reflect Null on, so... I was thinking about using Reflect, but no. Got the Mithril Claws. Still not the big thing, though. I'm just gonna have everybody defend here. Gonna steal. This seems to be just ramming. Couldn't steal. Rio! Welcome in, Rio. How's it going? Could not steal. Let me... Let me line up... Open. Let me line up a uh, steal here. Couldn't steal. And I'm gonna just... Speed... Speed shout out quickly. No! Rio! It is using magic. Everyone go check out Rio. <laughs> Rio's been doing some Mar Marios. Um, that's cyberpunk, though. But Rio's do been doing some Marios. Although, that's over now. Mario games are over forever. No more. Ever again. Let's do steel. What was it that you said you were gonna do up do next? It was a uh, uh, near automata, right? Or was that after the next thing? Oh, what's oh? <laughs> defend, yeah, defend, please. Rizaga again. Just on Echo. Oh, Echo's gonna, Echo's gonna trance here soon. Well, good thing we have two healers here then, I guess. Um. Sure. I was thinking about using, using um on Echo using reflect so that we don't get trance just yet. Defend. Come on, Zidane, please. Please. Just do it. Ahem. <clears throat> will be here for a while. Come on, Zidane, come on. Do it. Do it. Thank you for the shout outs, boss. Hmm. Next Rio stream is going to be Sun Sat. Saturday? <laughs> I think. <laughs> I think. Probably. Okay, now Echo's gonna trance. Ah, we don't need to use Echo, so we can just hold the trance. Dagger can do a healing. I don't think we've seen Echo's trance yet. Wait, it's the same as Vivi's, it just does double double white magic instead of double black magic. But it is quite nice now that especially now that we have holy, so we can just like we can we can drop in a few holies at the same time, so it's effectively the same as a double black magic in that sense. Come now, there we go, there we go. Let's go, let's go. Big attacks. Double holy and everything else. Let's see if that's enough.
It's the power of chocographs. Hmm. Curling up so our physical attacks won't really do much. But the Hamuk should still be doing plenty of damage. Um I guess yeah, yeah, that is what Bahamut usually does. And another double holy. This boss won't even know what hit him. Oh, Aker's actually running out of MP. Spamming these spells. Let's have Stein throw, a, throw an ether. In case these attacks don't kill it. Oh, they do. Easy fight. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Got some AP. Got some learning things. One is all. All is one. We'll never break the seal. Wag. Cool. It's got the same symbol as the Gulug's, Gulug um, stone here on the floor as well. Oracle can doesn't give us anything. Uh, it's, it's more powerful, but it doesn't give us anything in particular. The most powerful thief's dagger. Um, no new abilities through that. Don't think. Yeah, nobody's switching around anything around here. We can get Rune Blade now for Yai Strike. And Dagger got boost, so we can start learning. Let's start learning Concentrate. It's a good one. So hold up. There's an area of Ibsen's castle that I've forgot how to get to. Because I thought it was at the end there, but it's... Wait. No, I think it's at the beginning actually now. We need to finish the place and then go backwards. I think that's, that's how it works. Get to the Odin thing. These ones again. No, nope, I was attacking the gargoyle. That's a wasted turn, I suppose. I'll soften the gargoyle up. So now Stein is going to be doing even less damage. Became too soft to live. Yep, 41. Oh, we do we do now uh, blind enemies with our attacks, so that's nice, I guess. Bio. Go. 
level ups. No new abilities. Uh, yeah, this is where we need to go. Ah! Hey, are you okay? Of course I am! Maybe we we'll activate the traps when we reach the top. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Let's go. They're waiting for us outside. Except... That I want to activate the trap here. Maiden prayer. Oh yeah. Up on down. Up off. Uh, you got anything, Koopo? Nope. Oops, didn't need to open the mug shop. Ah, yes, here we go. This is what I was looking for. I was confused. Air racket, in case you still wanted some more weapons for this place. Golem's flute. I think it was clockwise that you need to move these around. Well, then it was counterclockwise. Obtain my power. Fight against the flow of time. Okay, sorry. My bad. It was the other way around. Should have should have known actually. Ipsen's castle, of course, is gonna be reversed. Happy soon. There we go. Received ancient aroma, and the other one just becomes nothing. So Ancient Aroma um, allows Dagger to learn, uh, where is it, over here, Odin's Sword. Item that radiates a mysterious light, raises shadow elemental attack. Odin's Sword uh, allows Odin to, <clears throat> when, when um, enemies are immune to being um, killed outright by Odin's Sword, uh, or by um, Zantetsuken, uh, then Odin's sword comes in and uh, you you don't... And uh, you... you Hold on. Yeah, yeah, then, then uh, if Zantetsuken is not going to work on them, then Odin's just going to do uh, massive damage on them. And Heatherly! Hello! The best Final Fantasy game ever is good. 
As you can see, we're just finishing off uh, disc three here. Um, although now I'm... Now I don't remember how to... No, I don't want to jump in the hole. How do we get the ones up top? Yeah, we're going to come back to this in a moment soon. So we'll go grab them then. Hey, sorry to keep you waiting. You came out first today. What? What happened to Amarant? He was waiting for us at the top and left as soon as we got there. I thought he took off. Is he still inside? You guys wait here. I'm gonna go look for him. I'm all alone. We just climbed to the top. <laughs> Made stuff and... No, don't jump. Don't jump. <laughs> this was the most difficult treasure to find. And a fork. Thank you. I mean, there really isn't even a uh, reason to be picking those up because we already have S rank in treasure hunting, so... Meh. Uh, who's there? Uh, who's there? Then, why do you come back? Amaran, what happened to you? Answer my question. I told you we might be enemies next time we meet. Or did you come back to mock me? You say some strange things. The guys outside told me that you hadn't come out yet. That's why I came, I came here looking for you. We don't have anything to do with each other anymore. Don't have anything to gain from this, or do you? I don't understand you. I don't understand the way you think. Who cares about what I have to gain? You need help right now. You don't care. Willing to put yourself at risk to save me. Come on, we've helped each other many times since we joined forces. You're a part of the team. That's all that matters. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I can't just walk away. It goes against my nature. That's what being a part of the team means. Isn't it? Come on, that's enough talk. Let's get out of here. Amaranth's back. Up off? Gonna check this one more time. Yep. No mail. Sometimes the Moogles are just like, um, you need to do a particular thing and then they'll be like, okay, I got, a, I got some mail. Listen up, everyone. Let's sort out what we found in the castle. On top of the castle is a mural, a map of the world. There were four mirrors on the mural. The writing of the mirrors was in language only I can read. My power is protected on the shaking ground. My power is protected behind a tornado. My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. My power is protected underwater, surrounded by the earth. I'm sure the mirrors are pointing us to locations that help us break the seal. What the monster said before he perished provided us with a clue about the seal. One is all, all is one. Meaning there is a connection between these four seals. So, what do we do? Are we going to take each location one by one? One is all, all are one. We're going to conquer all four locations at once. We're not going together like we always do? No, I'm going to drop off two of us in each location. I see. Hey, I'll go with Dagger. What? 
Why? It's called Ladies First today, and we get we girls have things to talk about. Uh huh. Is that okay with you, Dagger? Sure, but where are we going first? Well, the nearest location would be. One of the locations you mentioned is just south of us. Oh, you were listening to us. <laughs> I've been a sailor for a long time. I'm confident in my sense of direction. My power is protected underwater, surrounded by the earth. The location must have something to do with water. Why not go there first? Alright, thanks for your help, random crew member. Girl talk. Please, don't hesitate to ask me if you forget your destination. And please, remember to equip yourself properly while we are on board. You can relax, buddy. You are beginning to sound like someone I know. Diner just question mark. Alright, Erin, let's go. Yes, sir. Now departing. <clears throat> so... Uh, hold on. Let's pick up uh, where we left off with our team. And we're actually going to unequip everybody. Because the game kind of makes it seem like you should equip everyone with, you know, everything. But you don't. You really don't. New destination. I mean, actually, before we... Uh, let's drop them off right here. What a shrine. Are you going to be okay by yourselves? You're the one who suggested we split up. What? Don't you trust me and Dagger? Uh, it's not that I don't trust you. Hm. You just wanted to pair up with Dagger. You better get going. We need to take all points simultaneously. You're right. Where are you going next? And who are you going to drop off? My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. I think I'll ask Freya and Amaran to take that location. Alright, now, get going. Don't make us ladies wait. I'll be back to get you guys soon. Well, now that the men are gone, we can do all the girl talk we want. Girl talk? Goodbye! Um, I'm just gonna do Freya and Amaranth because they are being dropped off next. Um, okay, so yeah, we need to go to Gulu. Shimmering Isle. Ooh, wait a minute. It's on this side. No, it's it's no, it is right here. Yeah, Fire Shrine. Which actually isn't Gulug. Yeah, this is different. This is not Gulug. It's just like two two volcanic places next to each other. We're going to overheat. Just a little closer. Zdane, the heat is going to kill the engine if we get any closer. Okay. When we get closer to the volcano, you two head for the shrine's entrance. Why do I have to go with her? Oh, sorry. Did you want to go with Aiko? <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Good luck. Alright, our next destination is... Protected behind a tornado. Pairing up Steiner and Queena seems like a bad idea. I think I'll ask Vivi to babysit Steiner. Read. Pairing up Vivian, uh, pairing up Steiner and uh, and uh, Queena would probably not be a good idea. Ooh, this way. Wind shrine. Wow, the wind is strong. It's the wind shrine, so it's protected by strong gusts. Be careful not to get blown away. There's no need to worry. Master Vivi, just follow me. 
Uh, okay. See, there's nothing to fear. Really? Master Vivi. You're okay because you're wearing armor. Let us move forward, Master Vivi. Are they gonna be okay? But I'm with Pina. I should worry about more about myself. <laughs> <laughs> we should check our equipment and see what blue magic queen I can use. My power is protected under the shaking realm. Huh? Okay, so now that we are, you know, alone with Queena, now we can do some more adventuring. I just remembered that uh, we need to go and... Uh, I thought there was um, some stuff around here to find. Yep, tent. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Oops. Don't jump again. Mm. Nothing here. The engine is working fine. Then, this time I show my stuff. I learn more as I eat more. We are an airship. Maybe we go eat food from all around the world. Queen of being like, hey, teach me some blue magic, okay? I've been teaching you blue magic, though. I've been good. Uh, do we have Queen? Yeah, Queen is in the party already. That's nice. Um... So actually, before we head off to the Earth Shrine, let's go and drop off this Delazio that we got. Back at Treno. <clears throat> so the shrines, of course, are obviously a Final Fantasy 1 reference here. Four, four shrines that are different... Uh, Beans. Wait, where are we going? Oh yes, to Lazio, yeah. This this way. I don't remember if this is gonna give us anything interesting, but we'll do it. Aquarius, there you go. The eleventh coin. Then we have one more that we get on disc for, or actually two more, because there's the thirteenth. Thirty thousand gil. Okay, not that useful. Then I was expecting something, you know, item or an item or something like that. But also, also, you know. Now we have, uh, we have Queena in our party. We are forced to have Queena in our party. So... Why not make the most of it and, uh, go catch a few frogs? Uh, we should probably go with, um, some... We should, we should probably not really be looking at the best stuff, but rather... Oh, not, not the learning stuff, but rather just the best stuff. Blood and robe. Robe worn by Q's. Um. I mean, light robe is just outright better than the glutton's robe, giving plus one spirit and plus two magic defense. But it's pretty good, though. And uh, black robe also gives more magic, more defense. But I'll hold on to that for now. Um, let's do auto float. Now for Zidane, actually, we're going to want to have... Going to the Earth Shrine, so... You might be able to guess that we might want some... Uh, some protection from Earth. 
So let's equip Gaia gear. And also auto float. I think is gonna be handy. Queen can also do half MP. I'll keep add status maybe. What's the add status on the silver fork? Slow. Sure, sure. We'll go with that. Um, but yeah, let's go catch some frogs. Real quick. You thought we were doing main quest. We're gonna take a quick break. Quick frog break. Go visit each of the marshes and just uh, do a quick frog catching. Um, because that'll bring us pretty high on the frog amounts. And um, then on the next disc, they should all be already uh, replenished. Got him. Got him. Got him. Okay, we gotta catch one more male. There we go. And we got quail as well. What do we get? Bistro fork. Alright. So. We got a fork upgrade, even. All the froggies. No, 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 no. We're gonna leave. Leave some froggies here to to repopulate. Bistro fork, 68 attack. Add status sleep. Mm, I would say that's le less useful because sleep is something that bosses are more likely to be immune to, so. Could be better. Alright, uh, next up, the marsh over here. Yeah, yeah, we'll go to the one uh, on the Outer Continent last, since we're going to be ha going to the Outer Continent anyway for the Earth Shrine. I think the uh, frog catching is is a pretty nice, like, different kind of a mini game. Um, I'm not usually that big of a fan of it because it's just a little bit grindy. Oh, this one hasn't uh, replenished. When have we been here last? I feel like it's been ages since we did this one. I guess not. Um. I mean, we can capture the baby frogs and just leave the two adults here. Huh. Baby frog. And... Baby frog. But yeah, it's a bit, a bit grindy to get. Oh, oops. I picked the wrong one. A bit grindy good to the shop. 99, but I mean, understandable. So then there's the one on the northern part of the Forgotten Continent, and then the one on the Outer Continent. Airship Song doesn't quite get to play.
Ah, this one's repopulated at least. So how could the other one not have been? Because I don't remember going to it even. I, I yeah, I mean I guess we oh we, we do have we do have a babby in here, so Yeah, I suppose it yeah. Yeah yeah. They just take a while. I'm gonna need to capture Babby because uh, the the problem with babies is that you don't know their gender. Okay, that's the only male, actually. We've got three females left. Stupid frogs. Get over here. There we go. 42. And then we'll get six from the next one as well. No, I... Why do I keep doing it? Zidane is so dejected. We are going for more frogs. Alright, so one more marsh. I mean, it's a pretty good airship theme. What would be the best airship theme? Hmm, I don't know. I feel like the airship themes usually aren't the best of the best. I do think the best, probably the best, like, vehicle theme in the games must probably still be um, the ship theme from Final Fantasy 1. That's just... it's perfection. It's a male... Wait. 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 Oh no! <laughs> How was that? How was that? That is unlikely, but uh, I guess it happened. Um, that was the only male <laughs> out of all of these frogs, so I suppose for this marsh it probably doesn't make, make a difference to leave a female here, so we're just gonna grab all of them. Battle Boots. I think the Battle Boots are the last thing that Quail gives you um, before 99. So, I suppose... I suppose... We're just gonna catch all of them. Catch them all. Come on. Yep, yep. Don't run away. No! Why did I let him go? <laughs> I'm failing this whole thing. Get over here. Come on, frog. Yep. Oh. Get in here. Get in here. No. No. Stop. Stop running away. Stop it. There we go, finally. 50 frogs captured. Oh! We got flower in here! Had enough, Queena? Yes. I don't catching. Flower, please! What's a flower? Let's uh, shout out flower here. Cats organized neatly. What is... what is that? What is that? Also, that's golf. So that's not cats organized neatly. I feel like I might have heard about that game. It sounds like some sort of weird small indie game. 
Alright, so I think we are ready to go. I wouldn't mind a quick save though. It's a cat puzzle game. Hmm. It does sound like that actually now that you <laughs> mention it. That's what it would be. A game called Paul Cats Organized Neatly would probably be a cat puzzle game. Uh, do we need tents? 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 No tents. Alright, let's go in. A shrine. <clears throat> A shrine. Let's get going. How's Dan? You want to go with me? Well, uh, I sort of got stuck with the leftovers. You don't have to explain. I'm so happy. Huh? They're all saying in my tribe. Leftovers good. Uh, let's hope we find good things in this cave. Probably full, full of good food. Oh, Queena. Is no one here? Is empty. Yeah. Huh? What wrong? Did the ground just shake? Hop! Hop! This place is empty. It's too quiet. They probably just got scared of us and ran away. I hope so. Arg! I hate it when you fret like that. That's why I always worry about you. What are you talking about? Oh, nothing. I just have a lot of things on my mind. Look out! Aya! We're almost flat like pancake. I hope there aren't too many more of those. Dagger, please be safe. What the? It's a trap. Be careful. Ah! Let's go, Iko. Uh huh. He's placed to put mirror. Then put mirror. Okay, I put mirror. I'll place the mirror right here. I've been waiting for you. That was too easy. It must have been disappointing for you. Now I'll place the mirror here. Freya, stand back. It's just as Kuja said. He said I should expect intruders. Are you under Kuja's command? You're not a good person. Why do you work for him? No. We are the Guardians of Terra. Guardians of Terra? Yes, we are the Guardians of Terra, filled with the power of Terra itself. What is Terra? We did not become Guardians to chat with mortals. We derive pleasure from ending your worthless lives. Just to prove how powerful you are. So you understand, but will that knowledge help you? Foolish. What? Picking fights with strangers in a place like this. I used to know someone like that. He was a loser. He refused to find beneficial ways to use his power. Instead, he'd seek out people to fight. Amarant. What are you talking about? We'll show you what he means. Interesting, but you'll regret this. Ah, Grog! Finished already, such weaklings. You... He's too fast. I can't target him with my magic. We can't take him on with just the two of us. Master Vivi, 
A true man never gives up in a fight. But we can defeat this monster if we work together. So, which one of you will perish first? Silence. I shall vanquish you. What? Master Vivi, I shall attempt to hold him down. You attack him with your magic while I hold him down. But what if I miss the target? I trust you, Vivi. Okay. Arrgh! You just told us that we ate rats. Sorry, it's just the two of us. Did you have a feast prepared? You know worry. We eat everything. Ah, so you're attempting to conquer all four shrines at once. How futile. We'll see about that. Must try eating before we give up. What will you lower life forms do on Terra? We won't know until we get there. We don't have a plan. Must eat to find out what tastes good. Is my lesson from traveling around the world. Good. I shall show you the true meaning of fear. Woo. So they're of course called just guardians, but we do we know who these are. We know these people. Earthquake. Sure. Sure. You 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 try your earthquakes. Mighty God. Oh yeah, he's a bro. It's good old Lich. Stole Avenger. Lizaga. Hey, come on. That's not that's not Earth magic. Uh let's do a detect. What do you have? Also, are you are you are, is your level divisible by three? Rubber suit. Yes, please. Okay, let's steal a rubber suit then. Level 3, deathless. Steal. So Queen has something to do, you know. It didn't say miss. Devil slash. Ooh, Queen needs some heals. Couldn't steal. Let's, um... That's White Wind. We could also use auto uh, lives. Double slash and a miss. Stole the rubber suit. Thank you, Zidane. For once, being useful. Um, I feel like you could magic hammer Earth Guardian quite, quite a lot and, and like get through all the all of the MP. I remember that being a strat, but we're just gonna boink. Oh! <laughs> Sleep works! What kind of a boss are you? If you can just be put to sleep. Seriously. What a joke. Shouldn't take too many bonks here. Piraga. Okay, so another thing that would have been handy here. Um, I think basically if you do, if you do um, auto float and auto reflect, um, the only thing you need to worry about is Lich's physical dam, physical damage. And... But if you like, like this, this can be a very difficult fight, especially if you haven't trained Queen in anything. If uh, Queen doesn't have any blue magic, for example, it can be pretty bad. Um, and also, if you don't, if you don't come to the realization that Earth Shrine probably Earth magic, so that can also also be kind of bad. Flower, please, hello, Master Thief. 
It's a rule in here. Saying higher to everyone. All done. I wonder if everyone okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're waiting for us by now. Right, we go back to airship now. <laughs> Queen is becoming a great leader. So, interestingly, at this point in the game, we don't actually see the Water Guardian. We know who the Water Guardian is, of course. What? Why are you shooting me? <laughs> everybody else gets... Everybody else is, uh, is, is nice and a good shot. <laughs> fresh, air, fresh air, finally. Dane is unbelievable. Asking us ladies to fight a monster like that. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> What's wrong, Echo? Oh, I completely forgot. And we are all alone too. What, what is it? There's a question I need to ask you. I've been wanting to, waiting for a chance to ask you for the longest time. Give me an honest answer, okay? Well... You have to ask a question before I can answer. Do you love Dane? What? Why? You have to answer me. Do you love him or not? Hey, it's the airship. Zidane's back. Did you just say something, Dagger? Let's go, Aiko. Hey, wait, that's not, a, not fair. lost. Well, now that we've got everyone, we can head to the Shimmering Island. Hey, Amarant, I didn't know you were here. So we'll go to the Shimmering Island, then to Terra. Yeah, it's near Esto Gaza. It won't take long. Tell me something. What motivates you to do this? What motivates me? I do everything for Dagger, to find out what Kuja is after, or I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't even know why you do the things you do. I didn't say that. Maybe I do it because I don't know what motivates me. You understand something is interesting, but what's already understood is boring. I'm sure we'll understand something when we get to Shimmering Island and go to Terra. I'm beginning to understand why he won and I lost. I lost against his way of thinking. No, pretty sure you just lost because I was... I was hitting you hard enough. Okay. Uh, lowest levels get to, get to join in on the party. We have 27 in here. We have 31. And another 31. Mm, Queen has stuff, though. I need to check Queen has stuff up first. Queen off. Catch him. We catch him. In. Uh, who? Who was it? Wait a minute. Steiner. Yeah. Hog jam. Hog jam. There is no hog jam. <laughs> uh, hog jam club. <laughs> um. So we can upgrade back to Demon's Vest over here, which is probably the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Freya has... <clears throat> Freya still has... Oh, Fre Freya needs to downgrade now. Oof. Oof. Freya needs to downgrade so hard. From 77 to 31. Ouch. Diamond Helm for some ac accuracy. Defense gloves for some HP plus. Um, Genji armor for body temp and accuracy. Oh, we're getting accuracy already from there, so let's do... Oh, Genji helmet also gives HP plus, so... Then we can do Venetia shield for auto float. Um, and then... Um... Let's do let's do just whatever's available. So restore HP. Then Echo's got that one. No hats. 
Um, I mean, nobody's learning anything, so might as well just give Aiko the best hat. Who needs healing? Genji? We still need Holy. Then we have Rubber Suit, which uh, suit worn by women. Thunder damage reduced by 100%. Uh, but we already got that stuff. But Rubber Suit is actually pretty good because it just gives like a pretty um, balanced amount of stuff. And let's go for... Oh yeah, we were learning boost. There we are, Rune Blade. Nothing Helm. Whatever gloves. Let's go with Venetia Shield. Ability up. Auto Haste, and there we go. We have our new team. Let's check the stuff that they definitely have all the important stuff on, and what could uh, Freya do? Add status? I don't know if there's any status to be added. So we'll go with that. Uh, Zidane does not need auto float anymore. We can go back to gamble defense, and I mean, let's do steel kill. Aiko can actually go for Reflect Null now, so that's a pretty good combo there. Aiko can drop uh, drop Carbuncle and then still uh, heal through that. Uh, Steiner's gonna go for... Oh, well, Steiner's got a lot of trash here. Let's give Steiner counter and cover. Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. <clears throat> so we need to go to the Shimmering Island. Um, I was thinking, what's something we need to do before that? We could do like... No, I don't think so. I don't think so, no. But there's one particular thing I'm gonna do. Because this is the last moment. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save in slot 2. Because this is the last moment we get to listen to this map music. Rip this map music. It's so good. It's so good. Now I'm like thinking, is there, is there something else we need to do, but I'm... No. No. We got the stuff from Ibsen's castle, we got everything. We got it all, right? Yes. Shimmering Island. There's the forest, Stellatio. We already have all the Stellatios. What forest? The forest? Um, Mr. Zidane, I'm showing abnormal readings. It feels like the ship is getting sucked in. Dane, might be dangerous to keep going. Are we gonna bust in on the airship? All we know is that this is the entrance. I heard the people of Hesto Gaza call it the Spirit Road. Uh, the path that leads souls to Terra. Maybe it's a teleportation gate, like the one in Kuja's hideout. Mr. Zidane, we're going to get sucked in. What shall I do? What now, Zidane? We may not be able to turn back. Alright then, keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. We're going out on the deck. What do you mean? If Dagger is right, 
We can jump into the teleporter. From this height? We'll be fine. Considering all that we've been through, this is nothing. That's not how falling from a high place works. We're floating! The ending of Final Fantasy VII. Could this be Terra? What's this light? Could it be? The Terra music is also so great. I mean, again, all of this, this whole soundtrack is just the same song arranged in different ways. But it's always so good. It's always so good. So, you finally came. Time has come at last. Who the heck are you? Ask my name, will you? Let us ask. What is your name? What is your name? Me? My name is... Hey, what's your problem? I'm trying to tell you my name. So you believe a given name has meaning. Boy, you are being bewitched by the light of the blue moon. What do you know? You must be from Terra. You know nothing and that is all. Come and see for yourself. See what Terra is and what you are. Hey, hang on. He's gone. Zidane. Dagger, are you alright? Yes, everyone's fine. Come, let's hurry. Same team. Like some of some of terror reminds me a little bit uh, of um of uh, the Forgotten City in Final Fantasy VII. Exclamation mark? Question mark? Hey! Coronet? There's like a little bit of that same vibe here. In my opinion. Dragon wrist. Hold on, that's a new wrist. We haven't had one of those before. Jelly and Lancer. Hold on. Oh, it is actually... Why did I even remember this being a thing? But Dragon wrist is actually the only wrist uh, item that Freya can equip. Uh, in addition to Pearl Armor, of course. Um, but yeah, nobody really needs... Yeah, that's not gonna be useful for anyone. Everyone's got Jelly and, and um, yeah, Freya's got Lancer and nobody else can learn that. Elixir? Hey, wait up! I love the terror music track. No, that's what I said. <laughs> that's that's my opinion. Can't have it. Movers! Oh yeah. This is the good stuff. No, you. Virus combo. No. Don't do that. Vaccine. I 
I remember these guys. Yep. They're always good, good enemies to fight. Virus combo! Stop it! Okay, good. Not the same as the Final Fantasy VII iter iteration, yeah. They're moving together. Hiraga. Yeah, see if I care. Oh! That actually hurt. Got him! Wonder if Queena can eat them. Can Queena eat them? Jewel and Buddy Ten. Body temp, okay, we're still equipping that though, and Jewel. We still need Kyuraga. I don't think Kyuraga gets... Oh, Hamelin is actually the last thing that we're gonna have. Ah, uh, Tiger Racket as well. Let me Google lol. It's not as if I have Queen in my party though. Or will have Queen in my party ever again. Okay, we'll, we'll have Queen at some point. We'll do some Queen Eye leveling up. What's your problem? Where'd you go? Mithril Racket. Uh, jump. Hold on, something here? No. Movers! Let's have Echo nuke them. Uh, Freya should probably get out of the way. No! Virus combo on Freya. Well then, then we're gonna have to go for a full life. And an antidote from Steiner. Not an antidote, but, you know, the other thing. Vaccine. Okay, now let me nuke you. Virus combo and Steiner. Uh, I'll have Freya do use a vaccine on Steiner. I doubt that this is gonna exactly kill them, but, you know, just in case. That is four nines. Pretty good job there, Aiko. Hiu Raga. Aiko's just a little OP. A little OP with that holy. Still reorganizing though. I want to use another one. I mean, they're pretty cheap with half MP. No! Good. Dodged. Hate virus. Goodbye, mover. Getting some good EXP. Received a remedy. <laughs> I like the climbing sound in here.
demon's vest. Who are you? You don't remember anything, do you? Ah? Huh? Follow me and you will understand us. And maybe your own heritage as well. Hey, wait. Hold on a sec. Once you go on, you'll see. Okay. I shall go on. Mm. Minerva's plate. Um, let's see. Does it give to Freya anything? Restore HP actually from the. Um, <clears throat> yeah, Aiko can't learn it. Uh, I mean, meh. Location, question mark, question mark, question mark. Don't even know where we are. What the heck? What is this place? So my controller decided to stop working. It looks really artificial, so different than before. Yeah, but it doesn't seem very lively. Welcome home. This is where you belong. The place to which you shall offer yourself is here. Ran Bal. Hold on a second, what the heck are you talking about? Well, what the? I was going to say this time Dagger's not not painting again, but yep. Dagger, wake up. Dagger. Damn it, what the heck is going on? Keep saying that. You are completely oblivious. Just like a newborn child. You don't know why you were given life or for what purpose you exist. You simply shout to emphasize your life, your own existence. You are completely oblivious. We're gonna find a place for her to rest. Dane, leave the princess to me. You must go re 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 con re reconnoiter re reconnoiter at once. Yeah, you're right. There's gonna be some place around here. Chova has Steiner. I'll be right back. What? Can't take my my dago. Uh, who's the lowest level then? Vivi or Amarant? Uh, let's do Vivi. Now we got the brand bell music, which is also great. It does also come with this. Annoying sound right now, but... Ooh, Coronet gives Vivi return magic. Oh, yeah. That's what I like to see. Hydrope for auto-regen. Let's do auto-life as well. 
Veeves does not have the mm, the stuff for that though. Let's see, we do have body temp on still. I need one more point for that. Oh, we can take that status off. Let's put on the return of magic because that's kind of cool. There's so many things for you to equip. Hey, where'd Dagger go? Steiner? Steiner? What's going on? Everyone has a tail, and their hair is just like mine. I mean, we already found that we had discovered... Ung, it was me right off. That there are haircuts in the world of Final Fantasy. Only the Chosen may unlock the barrier. I'm not Chosen. Hey, what the heck are you guys doing? We develop into vessels. Say what? Okay, whatever. But hey, you have both men and women, right? Asexual beings would lack the genetic diversity to adapt to new environments. Huh? Hey, what are you guys up to? You look like a kid to me. We possess no age. We were built this way. Trying to find any place to go to. Gaia's blue light causes pain to those of us who were created by the civilization of Terra. Pain resistance is also a part of adaptation to the environment. The waxing and waning of the moon, the respiration of the planets. Motion is in stillness, stillness in motion. Wing Edge. Looks like a Moogle. What the heck is this? Thanks, Koopo. I was trapped inside, Koopo. Moo Rock. In return for saving me, Koopo, I opened a shop for you here. What's Morgonet? I've never even heard of it, Koopo. Do you want to try Morgonet? I need you to deliver mail. I wanted you to deliver mail to Mosme. Okay. Thanks, Koopo. Oh, I love Mognet, Koopo. Oh no, we we have uh, introduced mail to this place. Defender, that's a new weapon. Oh, we'll get an extra Holy Lance, extra Avenger, extra Bistro Fork. Ooh, Dragon Wrists. Coronets? We already have quite a lot of coronets. Yeah, I'll get one extra. Flash hats. Adamant hats. Uh, I don't want to go too high on the... Oh, we don't have too much left. Mm, platinum helms. Demon vests we have already. Minerva's plates. We'll ever only need three. Platinum armor. Two. Okay, otherwise we're good. Thanks, Murok. Found Elixir. Activity measurement 525. Surpasses basic value. Response value 356. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. We measure, measure their suitability as vessels for our research in order to create and grow a high, higher breed of genome. The flow of souls means that a planet has life. 
The stoppage of souls means that a planet is dead. A planet's color indicates its shape. Gaia is blue. Terra is red. Shape? I thought a planet's shape is determined by being a planet. <laughs> it's kind of kind of defaulting to a planet or its shape. Leading knowledge is useless to vessels, but information is given to prevent mental atrophy. Souls flow as the planets turn. When the souls of Terra and Gaia mix, Terra will be integrated into the larger Gaia. A planet's shimmer is its breath, a sign of life activity caused by the cycling of souls. This just takes us around. Yep. Heightened recognition of visual stimuli is necessary condition for bodies to be used as vessels. Hey, is there a place around here to get some rest? Why do you rest? Why? Don't you guys go to sleep at night? Not that I'm sleepy right now, but... By night do you mean the condition in which light recedes? Look, I don't have time for interviews. Where can I find an inn? There is the entrance. Right there. Gotcha. In time we will receive souls, then our bodies will begin to grow. Found the inn. This looks like a good place for Dagger to get some rest. But what's up with everyone here? They're all so stiff. I don't know why, but I have a bad feeling about this place. Well, first things first, I gotta bring Dagger back here. And get the treasure chest. Excuse me. Do you have any medicine? Hello? Is there a place I can buy some medicine around here? Yeah, there's a Moogle. Hello? I'm asking if you have any medicine. Nga! How come this place is full of weirdos? Everyone has a tail like today. Ah, if I could only find some Pima Pima herbs, it would make some wake-up powder for her. But is this my lucky day? No. Huh? Found ya. You're that girl, right? It's your fault Dagger collapsed, you know? Oh, never mind. Say, don't you have any medicine at all? He will soon awaken. How do you know? Where's your man? My man? My man? Are you talking about Zdane? Even I never called him that. But too bad for you. He and Dagger are super hard for each other. You don't have a chance with him. Tell him I am waiting in the underground laboratory. Oh, the nerve. What makes you think I'd tell him that? Hey, where do you think you're going? What a bingo. Uh oh, I don't have time for this. Oh, Echo. Dagger. Princess. Why must you suffer more? Damn it. What is the matter, Zidane? You haven't been yourself at all. What the heck do you mean? I haven't been myself. I'm sorry. I don't even know what's wrong with me. I just... I just can't concentrate with this blue light. Ah, uh, boo. Princess, you have awoken. What made you lose consciousness so suddenly? I remembered. Remembered what? It wasn't a storm that destroyed Madai Sari. It was... It was the eye on that airship that destroyed Madai Sari. You remember, don't you? The eye was also there when Alexandria was leveled. Yes, there was a large eye in the sky above from which light emanated. How did he mention it? It was there when Bahamut went wild at the ether tree. Yes, it was there in the sky. It must be the same airship. What? Then that must be the ship that slew her majesty. Rusty. Oh, I, I'm i sorry, princess. Don't worry about it. I've already come to terms with that. That ship took everything from me. 
It took away my parents, my homeland, Alexandria, everything. How terrible. Dagger, are you right? Yes, I'm fine. No, you're not. You're still pale. You gotta rest. Hmm. How come everyone looks so pale? What's wrong? No need to be concerned. A strange place such as this is cause enough for exhaustion. Oh. Hey, where are you going today? Oh, that's right. That weird girl. That girl who led us here said something strange again. She said she was waiting for you in some underground laboratory. What a pervert. Zdane. Treasure chest. Princess, why must you suffer more? Elixir. Nice, 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 nice. Better keep collecting those elixirs. And now I'm stuck behind Steiner. What a life to live. Um, now I would be quite interested in this, um, there's this one treasure chest right here. Down below us from here. <clears throat> I have no recollection of how to get to that one. I feel like it might be that we just need to... Like it's coming up soon. We need to first get beyond- Whoops! Did not want to get into a fight alone with Zidane. No, 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 no. I'm outie. Virus powder. Sure, 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 sure. Let me just flee. Yeah, I think we need to get through the gauge first. Run away! Okay, let's go to the lab then. I think we've uh, explored the place otherwise. Dot dot dot. Oh, so that's what's going on. Jeez, I should have guessed. So this is what you wanted to show me. Yes, I'm glad you understand. I don't want to understand. Sorry, but I'm not like that. I mean, all these guys with tails who look just like me. They're a bunch of zombies. They are my peers. We are genomes. We live in this village. Genomes? Is that what they're called? Not just them, but you and me too. It is the name of the seed given to all of us. Its name is Genome. Talk about a letdown. Who would have guessed that the home I have yearned for, yearned for would be a dump like this? No wonder I never found it. It's not even a Gaia. Why are you not happy? You have returned to the place of your birth. Happy? You guys can process that emotion. Look at them. Look at all their blank faces. What can we do? After all, we are made that way. And we are built to watch over each other and work together as soulless genomes. What's it all for? Get to the point already. How come I grew up on Gaia if I was born here? I'm alive. I have a soul. Why is everyone here so... Because you are special. What? We are mere vessels. You are being given a greater purpose. The will of Garland is absolute. Garland? Who's that? Garland watches over this planet. His mission is to restore the people of Terra. Restore the people of Terra? You mean people beside these guys here? They are merely vessels. So am I, and so are you. But the true people of Terra have been asleep for ages, waiting for their time to come. When the time is right, the light of this planet will change from blue to red, and Gaia will become Terra. Wait a sec. So the people of Terra are out to take over Gaia? What else can there be? Terra has always absorbed new planets to survive. And when the time comes, the souls of the people of Terra will occupy the genomes, 
Such is the restoration of the people of Terra. Why do people... Why do they have to be so tedious? Why don't they just wipe us out with magic like they did Alexandria? Once, Garland tried to use a more forceful method, but failed. Then he should just quit and leave Gaia alone. Because of his failure, he was forced to wait a long time. Wait until Gaia civilizations gained tremendous power. The power to use Eidolons. So that's why you attacked the Summoner's village and destroyed Alexandria. Planets have a cycle of souls. Souls are born from the planet and then return to it. Garland planned to gain control of that very cycle. And you were supposed to help him achieve that. What? Garland is waiting for you. Come. What do you think you're doing? I don't care about all this Terra and Gaia stuff. Dane isn't back yet. And with Dagger not feeling well, I wonder where he is. Eiko. No, Dagger, you can't get up yet. I'm alright. Listen, I want to ask you a favor. Oh, just tell me and I'll get right on it. I want you to go find Zidane. Huh? Oh, sure. Okay. Oh, I get it. You're getting jealous. No, I'm not. I just have a feeling something terrible is going to happen. Alright, I'll go get him. So you just stay here and rest. Ooh! Controlling Echo? Place to call home. No, no. Oh, yeah. What big stone? Why you are what stone? Is stone edible or is for barbecue? No answer. I think I like it. You know answer, so you know mind, right? Hmm. Very salty. Oh, do that. What are you doing here, Zidane? Huh? Oh, hi, Quina. You stand here, say nothing. Then you just like other dummy dummies. No can tell difference. They say someone always has doubled somewhere. There's so many of you here. The world's strange place, no? Yeah, I guess. Dang, what matter? You know, seem yourself. Hmm? I was nothing. I'm always myself. Besides, it's not just me. You look just like your master, too. Of course. Master Quell is Q-Clan. We've same. Yeah? I guess everybody looks the same to someone from another race. Hmm. Maybe you're right. What he say? Same race? Do you wish to rest too, Echo? Nah. Princess, why must you suffer more? Wanna play cards? Where the heart is. Excuse me. So, um, what do you guys do here? Hmm, oh, yeah. This blue light sure is pretty, isn't it? Vivi's good at conversation, for sure. You like it too, right? You're all looking at the blue light. The light is unpleasant to us. Oh, really? Huh? Is that girl... Hmm? Hey, Zidane. What are you up to? What do you mean? What are you doing, Vivi? I'm trying to talk with the natives. This boy here seems to be my age and everything. You're wasting your time. They won't give you a decent answer. Oh, but I think I can get truth to them. Huh? I'm surprised you feel that way. I don't know why, but... I... I feel like we're similar. Similar? What do you mean? I know they're similar to me, but... No, no. Not like that. They're a lot like the black mages we saw on the cargo shipping in Clara. Of course, we don't look alike at all, but I can see one thing. Their minds aren't hollow. I think that their minds are just out to lunch for a while. Hmm. Not hollow, huh? Hey, where are you going, Zidane? Zidane? So I think it's uh, it's really cool how in, you know, um, Final Fantasy IX was was all about like referencing the and and uh, attributing the old games 
um, and it goes all the way to the storyline itself and the whole like Gaia Terra thing uh, is something that we've seen before as well but what but they're still doing it in, in a kind of new way they're still like it, it's different it's just you can find these snippets from the previous games in here though came into this world This way. Hey, Zidane. What do you want? What? There's no way to say hello. What the hell is this place? I thought we'd find some mean mothers down here. But they're all a bunch of wimps. No challenge, huh? Yeah, I guess not. Hey, Amarant. Can I ask you something? No. Do you have any parents or family? What a stupid question. Sorry, I was just curious. I don't remember any loving parents. My first memory is of the face of a guy I had to fight. I only found meaning in life through combat. Funny how you put that in past tense, all due to my wonderful influence. What do you want me to do? Thank you. Please, you're gonna make me sick. How about you? What? You mean my parents? I don't have parents. Oh, Aiko. What happened to Zidane? Didn't seem much worry. I don't know. He just left without saying a word. We go look for Zidane together. Mm, okay, yeah, they're some, saying the same things. The truth. Can we handle it? Hey, where are you taking me? I told you, we are going to see Garland. Yeah, of course, but this way is a dead end. There is a way. See, you may find him through the portal. He awaits where the souls sleep, the floating castle, where souls bide their time until the restoration. Pandemonium. Will you not say farewell to your friends? I don't care what I am. I was born here, wasn't I? If so, then I am an enemy of the people of Gaia. You learn quickly. Make no mistake, I won't join your side. I just... If we are actually relatives, then... And I want to take care of this little family matter myself. Oh boy, is James going solo? Hey, Echo. Zane just went. You saw what Zane? Uh, yeah. Hello. Why did you stop him? Huh? How come? He was acting kind of strange. If you're looking for him, I'll go with you. And a new friend. Stilt skin. You want to buy a set of diamond, ether, and elixir for 2,222 gil? Yes. Thanks, buddy. I can continue my journey with this money. What a strange place. I mean, what are you doing here? How did stilt skin get here? And why did stilt skin get here? No idea. Um, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. No need for any any uh, saves or anything. But I am actually now getting a little worried about that one treasure chest there. Let me let me see. How do we get that one? Oh, 
Oh, it's right here. There we go. Okay. I was... I was dumb. It was right here. Hippity hoppity and flash hat. We already have some of those, but why not? More is more. Okay, Amarant, you joining in? Say, Amarant, did Zidane go this way? Yeah, seems so. He had a real serious look on his face. I knew something was wrong. Gonna go look for him, right? Huh? Trying to say I'll go with you. Catch my drift. We got a new team! Uh, so Echo is equipped up. Um, let's give... Green has some stuff. We are pretty good with everything here. Green has actually learned most things already. Uh, Queen is going to learn Auto Reflect. <clears throat> then we can go for Avenger. Red Hat. I mean, uh, is Thieves Gloves are worse than, than the Dragon Wrist, actually? Yeah. Demon's Vest. When are we learning? Yeah, we were learning Long Reach on Amaranth. Now you listen to me, where did you take Zidane? He went on his own to see Garland. Garland? Ooh, that's a sinister name. But Zidane wouldn't just leave us hanging. He went, yes, he went to find out the reason for his existence. Liar, that's a terrible lie. I am an enemy of the people of Gaia, he said as he walked through the gate to Pandemonium. We, we gotta tell the others. Heaven grant the wandering soul's eternal repose. Oh. Repose. So, this must be Garland's haunted mansion. Talk about bad taste in interior decorating. Alright, time to teach this tyrant a thing or two. Then you should not be going in solo. So, we meet again. Who are you? Twelve years ago, I lost one of my most prized genomes. I created him and sent him to Gaia to disrupt the cycle of souls there. You are that genome. Glad that you have returned. Shut up. Nobody tells me what to do. And I didn't come here to answer to you. Let me guess. You must be Garland. What if I am? Then you're going down, but first you're gonna tell me everything. Like why did I grow up on Gaia, and why do you want to destroy it? I have no intention of destroying Gaia. I only wish to make Gaia into terror. What did you say? Of course, not everything went as planned. You growing up on Gaia, for example. There is another one built as you were. He may be the one who threw a wrench into my gears. He? Who the heck are you talking about? Someone you know quite well. Follow me. The time when the aura of Gaia will turn to the crimson glow of terror has not yet come. I may need your help anyway. 
Hell. Pandemonium. Stop. Now tell me everything. I constructed the genomes to be vessels for the souls of the people of Terra when they awaken. But 24 years ago I gave life to a genome that was very much like you. His will was too strong to make him into a proper vessel, and I even considered discarding him. But then I thought that I should put his strength to use. I sent the genome as my servant to disrupt the cycle of souls on Gaia. Yeah, so tell me who he is already. Do you not yet know? You and he are so much alike. Alike? I've never met anyone like me. Judge only by appearances. I mean, someone with a soul similar to yours. The one I sent to Gaia might also be called your brother. His name is Kuja. Kuja? He's a genome? Impossible, he doesn't even have a tail. He's only hiding it. He denies his own identity. He rejects the meaning of his existence and tries to assert his own individuality. Don't you see the resemblance? Shut up, I'm not like him at all. I said the same thing when I'm speaking about the other genomes. I'm not like these guys. Hmm? I piqued your interest in Kuja and yourself. Okay, we need to go this way. Must follow. His ambition was unbecoming of a genome, but it was perfect for the mission I gave him. To bring war and chaos to Gaia, that was what I sent him to do. To induce an unnaturally chaotic flow. So then why? The disruption of flow of souls is best brought about by war. And what he did for me far exceeded my greatest expectations. What about me? How did I end up on Gaia? When you received a gift of life in Branbal, Kuja could not bear it. He could not bear to see a genome with more power than his own. He felt threatened. Discard of you, he dropped you onto Gaia, the world he would destroy. So I was to be your slave, just like Kuja, to start a war on Gaia? That is correct. I did not expect Kuja to abandon you, but I believed it was his nature. And to him, bringing war to Gaia would prove his victory over you. Perhaps it is because of his desire. justify his existence that he let you live as well. So that is why the blood of thousands had to be spilled? Are you referring to Kuja's ambition, or to our plan to disrupt the cycle of souls? Both. And what exactly do you gain by disrupting that cycle of souls or whatever? Must sort the souls. I want to disrupt Gaia's cycle and drain his souls, filling the void with the, soul, with the souls of Terra. To speed the cycle of souls is to speed the work as a whole, thus war. And in time, Gaia's souls are gone, and Gaia becomes Terra. But how? You saw it with your own eyes, you saw the ether tree and the mist it emits. The role of the ether tree is that of soul divider. The mist you see comprises the sa stagnant souls of Gaia. Oh yeah? But we stopped the mist, so much for that. What you saw was the back of the tree. Even now the ether tree blocks the flow of Gaia's souls while it lets those of Terra flow freely. Come and see for yourself. See the true form of this planet. What is this? 
Think of it as an observatory, a place to measure the radiance of Gaia and Terra. What are you talking about, and what is that weird light? That is the center of a planet, the end and the beginning of the cycle of souls. The light remains Gaia's for now, but when the blue changes to crimson, all will belong to Terra. This restoration will be complete. That is why I wrapped up the light in the ether tree, to prevent the cycle of the judgment of souls on Gaia from inside the planet. Such is the ether tree's true purpose, its true form. All you saw was its material form. The flow of Gaia's souls cannot be changed simply by stopping the disposal of mist. So, Puja is just an angel of death who sends souls to the tree of Aoife? Yes, my angel of death. But only until you came of age. What do you mean? Soul is not internal. I was going to create you next, after all. You mean... You won't need Kuja's soul once I grow stronger than him? Precisely. Soon that time will come. Well, now you should be fully aware of the meaning of your existence. Yeah, I'm aware of all the la laughter, all the tears I've shared with the people I grew up with on Gaia. Forget all that. You are destined to live among the stars for all eternity. You have the power, the position, and the motive to do it. I wouldn't want that kind of power if I only had a place to call home. My brothers in Tantalus, Vivi, Freya, Amarant, Quina, Steiner, Aiko, and Dagger. My home is with them in Gaia. If you say I have a motive, then it's to punish all of you who brought pain to my friends. I'll destroy Terra. That's reason enough for my birth here as a genome. Incredible. I thought your soul would be perfect for a new angel of death. I am the new angel of death. Yours! Don't you know what it means to meet your maker? Shut up. I've heard enough of your crap. I'm taking you out right here, right now. Yes body becomes a vessel which greets a new soul. What's happening? It's too good to make into a regular genome. But I have no choice. Oh boy. Zane got soul stolen Ung. I can't believe I actually returned to this place but soon soon the power will be mine alone Mwahahaha. just you wait Garland and you too Zidane I'll exact sweet revenge upon you both for insulting me I'll make the people of both Gaia and Terra know who rules over all of them Ha 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 I was called that once. Many people call me that. You always have to show off, don't you? Yeah, maybe I do. Why, you worthless mendicant. Yep, sounds about right. How very becoming of you. Becoming of me. I really learned a lot by traveling with you, Zidane. Yeah, right. I have nothing to teach teach me many things more important than tasty munchies. No, I don't know anything. You call that friendship. 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 Zane! I don't know who I am. 
You were always there for me, Zdane. So tired. Come, you're always so. I. I am. Empty vessel. Zdane! Wake up, Zdane! Ooh. Come on, Zdane, wake up! Ow. Zdane! Vivi. Echo. Thank goodness you're alive. We thought you were dead. Oh, I... We were so worried. Why do you come here all by yourself? What are you doing here? Huh? We came to save you, of course. And it wasn't easy. You went off all alone. Leave me alone. Huh? This has nothing to do with you. Oh, come on. There he goes, being the tough guy. Look, Zidane, it's not just about you. Come on, Zidane. Don't be like that. Let's... Shut up. Just shut up, you stupid brat. Zidane? Zidane. Zidane, wait up. You need rest, Zidane. If you little twits just shut up. There are some things kids can't understand. <coughs> Zidane's not feeling too well. With an Abducius here again. We already beat one of these. I mean, this whole section is pretty bad if you die here because it looks like you need some help. Because, um, as you may have noticed, the last Moogle was in Branbao. In this version, of course, we have autosaves, but in the original, you would have to go back to the Moogle in Brambo and go through that whole big, big cutscene with, with Garland and everything. Pretty rough. Mm. Let's antidote. And let's bring Raise Wind here. But this song is pretty cool. Bio again. And antidote again. No, let's do uh let's do Lancer with Freya. Zidane can do antidote himself. Bonk. Do I have anything else? Not really. Lancer? Oh, it dead. Can't you even take care of yourself? Not really dead. Amaran just joined in. Um, go for the kill. Bonk. Bonk. How foolish of you to go alone. Damn hypocrite. Always talking about friendship when you're nothing but a selfish loner. I can take care of myself. Come back, Zidane.
Ungwa. Aya. I will not be defeated so easily. Now I'm mad. I cook you good. Steiner. Queener. What are you doing? Have a thief. And also, like, if you're if you're particularly low leveled at this point, uh, these fights can be pretty tough. Um, and it also, as you can see, it kind of expects you to have equipped everybody with some good stuff. So, if you've just been uh, unequipping everyone of everything, then you're gonna have a bad time. I don't think we have everybody equipped with um, something. Let's do a white wind, please. You guys, you're late today. What you doing? High wind again. Let's counter with white wind. I don't recall any of these having any uh, items to steal. I could do a detect. Uh, actually, I want to kill this real quick because um, Zidane is about to get uh, trance. Well, Queen has got trans. I don't think I can eat this. Can I? Not sure if we can even cook it. I know can eat. Yeah, thought so. We can have... Oh, it's dead. I was say we can have Queen do a slap, but... Right, so Zane's gonna trance in the next fight, basically. Hmm. What an unworthy opponent. Zane, you know can leave us. I still want you taking me place to have lots of good food. And I have not yet concluded whether you or not you are the right man for Her Highness, mind you. Just... Leave me alone. I don't want to trouble you anymore. You're all a bunch of babysitting bastards. But trust me, I know that I'm the worst bastard here. It's a big one. Shell a dragon. Charge. 666. And that is trans time. So this is actually like a section that I'm, I think it's mentioned in the level one uh, guide as being a particularly hard one. And I can imagine like doing this at level one. Cause I think Zidane's got ev like maximum defense here and that charge would have killed you at level one, even with all the equipment we have. So, I mean, maybe with like HP plus and I don't know. But it's just crazy. We're gonna we're gonna try it at some point, but not today. <laughs> Grand lethal. Earth 
shake. Do I have, do I have any earth protection on? We need to go for Neo Twister. Nope. Mio Twister. Hmm. <laughs> Almost the same amount of damage. Earth Shake again. Ooh, boy. I think I'm going to drop an ele elixir here. On the last uh, trance. Smash, and I'm using Detect. <laughs> like a fool. Aha. We got help. Dagger. Is this how you want to solve the problem? A dagger to help us. Detect. Carries Elixir, Phoenix down. Not worth it. Um, uh, I mean, we haven't even summoned Leviathan. Atomos, actually. I don't know how much health it has left, but let's do Atomos. We haven't summoned Atomos either. G Force 199. He has a big mouth. Miss. <laughs> Great job, Atomos. Great job. Smash. Okay, let's do a Kiraga then. And full heal. Smash again. I mean, don't you do smash. Ooh, charge! Just kill dagger! Ooh! Ooh! This is not good. Oh no! Not good. Smash! Oh no! Uh. uh I gotta go for the elixir. <laughs> I wish we had it. Uh, we, we could try if. Uh, ooh, Alexa, I wish we had explosions in this game. Ooh, no. But I guess that's why uh, Alexa is so plentiful. You don't have it. Uh, Phoenix down. This just went bad. I needed to use smash now. Not charge. Nope. It used charged. Uh, I needed to smash Zidane. Because then Dagger can use a Kiraga. Please smash. Thank you. Kiraga. Okay, so Dagger is in kind of... Oh, I know. It's because Dagger's still in the front row since Ibsen's castle. I need to have Dagger change rows. That's the problem. Um, please don't charge. Yep, it charged. Okay, that explains things. Okay, please smash. Thank you. Raga, attack. Dagger needs to needs to switch to the back row. Oh, 
bonk. Okay. Whew, killed it. That was a that was a close one. Dagger. You try to do everything by yourself, don't you? Try to understand. I don't want to cause trouble to anyone. Aren't you aren't we your friends? I want to think so. Why I always Look, I'm not from Gaia. I was just a hair hair breath from becoming the destroyer of Alexandria. I can't accept your friendship so easily. You've always protected us. But you still don't understand that we look out for you too. We watched your back while you watched ours. And we believed in you the same way you believed in us. Just like you protected us. We want to protect you. Dagger. You say it. My master tell me somebody give you tasties, you give them tasties too. It's good manners. I still not cook you succulent frog yet, then. Queena. Chivalry requires a knight to look after his comrades in arms. I will not abandon you. And I shall follow you to the kingdom come if I must. You remember that. Steiner. Ha. Huh. What am I gonna do with you guys? The feeling is mutual. Alright, let's go. Wait. Where are the four others? You don't think they've been trapped? Impossible. You should not have left them. That's right. I mean, really. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry. Let's head back together this time. Yee! We are together again. Zidane is good again. Ooh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> we have not touched dagger since Ibsen's cast. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. Um. I mean, let's do Tiger Record, so Dag nah, Dagger's not going to need to do... We, we can cast the Hamut. Um, nothing really here. Holy hat. Um, yeah, the hats don't really help in any particular way. Product Flash Hat. No, no, Holy Biter. Holy Mitre for the bonus. Uh, Dragon Wrist. Rubber Suit. Nah, White Robe gives a little bit of magic. Not that we, like, need a lot of magic on, on, uh, on Dagger, but a little bit of something. We have Auto Haste in here. So let's go for Auto Reflect next. Right. And wait a minute, Dagger is in the back row. Oh, it was just oh yeah. It was just because Dagger didn't have anything on. This is completely naked. Nothing around here. I'm gonna go find them. Zidane. Zidane, why did you leave us? I'm... I'm sorry. You were right. I need everyone's help. Don't leave us again, okay? Never. So you had a change of heart. What a busy guy, coming and going all the time. Yeah, but not anymore. We have to stop Garland. Oh yeah, that's right. A Mughal followed me all the way from Brambar. Just tell me if you need her to rescue, though. Alright, now we can work our way out of this depressing castle. Because we are all together now. Yay! Um, I think we'll keep this team. I mean, Freya needs some levels. We might as well go with, go with the team we have now. Switch party members. Mugshot. Mugshot probably doesn't have anything new. Nope. They mug shop as before. 
Um, we can tent. I guess we need a tent, probably. Let's make a save, just in case something bad happens. I doubt it. We are pretty, pretty strong at this point. And Paul. Oh, I love Mogadet Kupo. Okay. Goodbye, Murok. You are the best of us. Received Holy Mitre. Oh, yeah. Second one. Oh, this place. Find a button. Press it. Thirty. Oops. Move us. Well, time's up. And we can try to escape. But uh, time's probably up. Please. Yeah, not gonna be. Not gonna have enough time here. Just getting out of combat takes more than 30 seconds, so. Just a random battle. Ah, Shell Dragon. My old friend. Roar. Uh, would the Shell Dragon perhaps have anything to eat? Probably not. I mean, let's see if you even can eat it. Or if it's just gonna be cannot eat. No can eat until weaker. Okay, so we can eat. Uh, let's do a scan on it. I do wonder if it's a different um, shell dragon than the one we fought as a boss. I guess if we detect it, we can see if it's got the same stuff. Um, let's go ahead and armor break it. Um, yeah, it's, it's less. 12,000 damage. It's a dragon. It is weak against ice. Yeah, it's different. Phoenix Pinion and Tent. And Vaccine. And High Potion. Let's bring uh, Shiva in, since it's weak against Ice. And then let's see if uh, Zidane needs to attack. We're looking for it to take... Um... Oh, it snorts people. Well, that's annoying. Smash. Well, that gives us Limit Glove, so... Thank you. Shiva time! Hmm. Not as much as I was expecting. Eh, let's kill it off. <laughs> yeah, he's snorting people away, so... Let's get rid of it. Um, limit glove. Bonk. No! It killed Queena. Oh no. Oh no. Hmm. Zdane could probably kill it with, with another smash. I think it's gonna die from this. 
Oh, Zidane's also gonna gonna die from the next attack. Whew. That was kinda close. Zidane steals all the EXP. Current altitude 1, current heading 0, standard heading increase decrease value. Um current heading is 5 0. That's I don't remember, so let's try one first. Let's go see what's what's going on with this. First heal. I find it unfortunate that um half MP doesn't work in in the in the menu. Uh we need to turn it around to like if this one three three I'd say three We didn't have a possibility of fidgeting with the altitude, did we? No. I think that's correct. Uh, yep. Twenty thousand and seven gil. And the walls have eyes. I think we need to get to this point. Ah, this is just gonna take us back up. That brings down Okay, I need to turn around here. I think maybe to... Oh boy! We got our good friend Malbro here. Our good bro Malbro. Well, I mean Malbro actually. Let's get a... let's get a eat on this one. Oh, whoops! Attacked with Queena. Didn't mean to do that. What's your health, Malbro? Um, 9,478. Out of about 12k. Okay. Um, okay, it's about 4,500 now. Uh, 3,000. I'm gonna do one more attack as Steiner, and that should be it. Queena should be able to go for an eat. Let's do a Kuraga here. Could be weak enough for an eat. Bad breath. Please no. Okay, Steiner's Steiner's in bad shape, but we're all good. We're all good here. Eat. Learn bad breath. Thank you. Woof. Good old Malbros. Am I right? Um, we only need to do eye drops. Standards doesn't have any MP, but I don't think that's going to be a problem. Alright, so we need to turn around, um, five, four, three, 
There we go. Um, let's see if this is correct. Um, I think, yeah, I think because now it opens up to this one, I'm pretty sure. Yes. Got it. Got both of them first try, basically. Oh. We go that way. Or do we? Um, go up one floor. Go up one floor. Okay, well, let's start with this one. Oof. Reminds me of uh, Final Fantasy 1. Elixir. The horrible trials. I like that the encounter rate in this game seems to be kind of low. Harabini male. That's a new one. Steiner. Yep, auto region. Nice. Um, so we should not go to the one uh, up top. And we should not go to this one. So whatever's left is the one we need to take. The one on the left, or down. Down and left is where we need to go. Go up floor. Yep. Here we go. So again, we took the right one at the very beginning to find the treasures. I mean, I swear, it feels like I've played this game before. But I really don't, I, I don't have these places memorized or anything. It's just luck and also probably some sort of weird subconscious memory of this. Got some battle boost from there. We have way too many battle boosts now. There we go. We got through this thing. And we have a Moogle. What up, Koopo? Mosbane. You must be a letter. A letter from Moorock. I wonder what about. This is my first time using Mognet. And my first letter, Koopo. Hmm. What should I write about, Koopo? What the heck was that all about, Koopo? <laughs> What's Mognet? Um, we can switch party members. Uh, let's use a tent, so, um, if Steiner wants to use some MP, add it. And, plus, uh, Steiner, does Steiner have, a uh, MP attack on? Should have MP attack on. Nope. Mm. Antibody. We don't need antibody. MP attack instead. Danger ahead, Koopo. Do you still want to go on, Koopo? <laughs> no. <laughs> Let me make a save, then. I know there's danger ahead, but... I wasn't thinking it was dangerous enough for you to give me a warning. 40 hours into the game. This has been pretty good, pretty, pretty good pace here. at the end of the day. There's the observatory. You told me you'd become my angel of death. But I think for a moment, isn't life death itself? You must kill other life forms to survive. 
Sometimes it even kills those with whom it shares blood. To live is to give life meaning, yet one must take others' lives to survive. A mature civilization becomes aware of this paradox. Terra's souls will sleep until they forget such nonsense. They will begin a new life in a new dimension. It's a world in which life and death become one. That is the dimension in which we are meant to live. Beings that transcend life and death. Dane, I'll ask you one more time. Who are you? You're a sad man, Garland. We know more than you. We're not perfect, but we are friends who help us. That is reason enough for us to live. I may not know who I really am, but that is my question alone to answer. I exist to eat, but also exist to live. We may be weak, but that's what makes us work together and help one another. Then show me. Lecture me again when you are on the verge of death. Oh boy, silver dragon time. Yobo's theme. Just, uh, Garland's. Garland's theme here. Hmm. Aerial Slash. I think Dagger's job will pretty much be just healing. Um, Zidane's gonna go into Trance, which is quite unfortunate. I wanna see if there's... He uh, might not even have anything worth stealing here. Shockwave? Don't trance Zidane. Oh, you didn't. Thank you. Detect. Let's see what you got. Kaiser Knuckles. We already got those. Dragon Mail. I don't think we had that. And Elixir. So, okay, we do, we do want to steal. I guess we're going to be wasting uh, Zidane's. Zidane's uh, trance, then. It's really unfortunate how the whole... whole uh, trans system works in this game. Cura. Uh, I should probably go for Curaga now. Stole Elixir. Oh, we can also do... Um, just so everyone's in, in better shape, we could do also... Uh, mighty God. Oh, Dagger's dead. Okay, Steiner, please. Uh, Phoenix down Dagger, and then Queena's gonna do White Wind, because we need some healing here. And Steel. Four. Now Steiner's in France. Raga. I feel like this thing is cheating. It's getting more turns than it should. I mean, Trans Steiner is going to be able to come in with quite the quite the hit when the time is right. We don't have Ragnarok equipped, so it's not exactly the the strongest attack that Steiner can do right now. But it'll be pretty good. Um, oh yeah, so let's do let's do Mighty Guard. So we have a little bit more protection because this thing is hitting kind of hard. Pura. Aerial Slash coming in again. We're gonna probably need to do a heal here. Couldn't steal. Come on, Zidane. Come on, please. I would prefer Dagger not going to, into Trance here as well. Let's just give this, the, the Trance to Steiner here, please. I think we might be going into, into uh, Dagger's Trance as well. 
which is quite unfortunate because that means the dagger will won't be able to do much. Twister. Mm -hmm. White wind. Twister hits dagger pretty hard. Stole the dragon mail. Okay. Um. Hmm. I think I'm gonna start attacking with Steiner now. Um, because the Kaiser Knuckles we already have, so, you know, I won't be, it'll be fine if we don't get it, you know, but I'll keep trying to steal. But we'll have Steiner, uh, keep attacking. Shockwave! Counterattack. Oh, Steiner's going in hard now. Oh, double attack. And blinded it. Woof. I had actually never considered that uh, as an option. That Steiner could actually just hold in trance and instead just rely on counterattacks. Because then you're getting free attacks without. Yep. <laughs> Free attacks without using up your trance. How about that? New strat. Well, we got the dragon mail. Didn't get the knuckles, but... We got Sonic. We don't need and knuckles. I'd love to switch my equipment around now. Garland, tell me. What is it that you want to accomplish? The restoration of Terra. Isn't it obvious? No, that's what the people of Terra want. Why aren't you asleep with the rest of them? I was created to oversee Terra. I exist to wait for a time when this world is without life or death. I am the absolute controller of this planet. Now we get some boss music. Is Garland. What up, Garland? Steel. Psychokinesis. Oof. Keep healing. Stole ninja gear. Uh, I should actually, again, check. What are we looking for here? Detect. I don't remember if, if uh, Garland has any, like, powerful AoE attacks. I feel like that's Silver Dragon's thing. Silver Dragon comes with the AoE and then Garland just kind of... Oh! Yep, Garland has some pretty powerful single target spells like Flare. Dagger's about to trance. Dark gear and battle boots. <laughs> I really don't need any more battle boots. Um, we could do a mental break. We can garland down a little bit, possibly. Detect. No, steal. Oof. Mizor Takayashi with the hydrate. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Miss. Soul Battle Boots. Thank you. Okay, we need to get the Dark Gear. Miss. Steel. Rolls to chat and back out. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Don't. Okay. Don't attack Dagger, please. Not yet. Soon. Once I steal, then you can attack Dagger, because then we're gonna bring in the Eidolons. Yep, you just keep attacking, attacking Steiner, that's fine by me.
couldn't steal. Come on, Zidane. Don't stop. Don't stop. Just remedy clear stop. It does, okay. Never remember which... Flare? Stop spamming your attacks. Oh, that was actually pretty, pretty strong. Let's throw in a Cura on a Zidane here. Steel. Wave? Oh no. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I love Queen's Dodge animation. <laughs> Fit perfectly there. <laughs> uh, Garland coming in with a super beam and Queen just kind of dodge. There. Oh, now Dagger's gonna. Oh, gonna trans. I guess we gotta use Queena to do some uh, do some healing now then. Uh, white Wind. Oh wait, Dagger didn't trans. Dagger, what's wrong with you? Just, just do it. Just do it. I mean, don't do it. Not yet. But just do it. Wave. <laughs> Queena just. Queena is. You, you won't be able to hit Queena with that. Stop. On dagger. Alright. Let's have a remedy on dagger then. <clears throat> Don't want people to be stopped. Although I wonder actually. If stop stops. The trance gauge from also increasing. I guess it would, because, yeah, it would. Huh. Stone Dark, yeah, okay, let's go! Okay, now, give it to me. Hit, hit dagger, hit dagger. Hit dagger, please, hit dagger. Thing is, I don't want to, like, waste daggers, trance, or something else. I want to, I want to use it this, in this battle. Give it to me. Hit dagger. Nope, that's Queen. That's the wrong person. Dagger. Darn it. That's the day. I'm gonna speed this up. Come on, Garland. No, don't kill Queena. Come on. I want you to hit Dagger, not with stop. Just, just, just give me the trance already. Just give me the trance. Just, just give it to me. Give it to me. Not stop. How annoying. Nope. That's done. What? Dagger still isn't going into trance? What is this? Dagger just completely refuses to go into trance. And also, I didn't hit Hirago and everyone there. Bit of a waste. Bit of an overheal. Okay, come on. There we go. There we go. Alright. Let's go. Eidolon. Bahamut. Go. White Wind. And attack. Mega Flare. Got the full animation and everything. I bet we're gonna 
<clears throat> we're gonna kill Garland before the Eidolon um, trans thing even even happens. Um, so so what what uh, Garnet's trans does is you summon an Eidolon, and then uh, there's a chance. Or well, the Eidolon then comes back periodically during battle and does this like short animation attack again. So as long as the trance is active. So we're gonna see Bahamut come in again and again on this, perhaps. We're gonna have to go for a Kiraga here though. Luna Pog. What up, Garland? Ye you want another Bahamut to your face? I got another one. It's coming right now. Nope. Oh, it is. Mega Flare. <laughs> there we go. Right now. <laughs> Bahamut is just like hanging out there in the background and ready to throw some throw some uh, mega flares all according to plan well that stop is not according to plan let's get Queena to fix that wave you can't wave Steiner Steiner stop oh I should have paid attention I wonder if that, that uh, affected Steiner's trans gauge. Mega Flare! What's better than one, um, one Bahamut? One Bahamut that just keeps attacking. Psychokinesis. Come on, Garland. You're a joke to me. Flare. Uh, we might need some heals in here. Garland using Flare when I have Mega Flare. <laughs> Garland is blinded. What a fool. Mega Flare! And this is like, this is the reason why for Dagger you don't want to actually do anything. Um, after you've summoned an Eidolon, for Dagger you want to just like, stop doing anything. Which, of course, can be a bad trade-off, depending on the situation. Dead. Ugh. Yeah, ugh you. Wait, no, it's free, free Eidolons. You fight well. Give it up, Garland. Huh? What the? Ha 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 ha! This is too easy. The Invincible is mine. Now I have the power to control all souls. Garland gave me everything without a fight. The old fool was too busy dealing with him. Now only death awaits him. Poor Garland, bitten by his own dog. This is no accident. Fate has chosen me to become the new ruler of Terra. Time for me to put on the finishing touches. I must say, I truly love you all. You not only broke the seal to Terra, 
but did me, did me the favor of defeating Garland. Zdane, you are truly an extraordinary genome, deserving of my love. What are you doing here, Kuja? That's not a very nice way to greet your brother. Shut up, you're no brother of mine. Oh, such ferocity. Master Garland, he intends to fight Terra. Ah, what are you scheming? Scheming? Me? Watch me as I defeat these enemies of Terra. Come on now, you may sleep alongside the souls of Terra. For all eternity. Oh boy! We're fighting Kuja? Thundaga! Cool spell. Um, do you got anything cool? Do you want to steal from me? Ooh, that actually hurt. Light robe, Herbini mail, and ether. Oh, let's get those. Sure, let's go for it. Um, so this is the end of this uh, this three in the game, and I made an observation actually on uh, Twitter the other other day that um the PlayStation era of Final Fantasies has this specific thing about them unique to them which is the changing of the discs um, because they are on multiple discs unlike any other like Final Fantasy 2 uh, Final Fantasy 2 Final Fantasy 10 on the PlayStation 2 was just one DVD which was a big change again uh, and of course like the Final Fantasies before were just one cartridge so it was it was a different thing to have like multiple discs but what it made what it what it caused in the like story writing of the games is i think pretty good in that it forced um it didn't really force but it made the developers um like create these big big moments for the endings of the discs and uh, also these palette cleansers for the beginnings of them. So like, in in this in this game we had the first disc end in Burmesia, uh, getting defeated by Beatrice, which isn't the biggest of all disc one endings. Like in Final Fantasy VII, for example, disc one's ending is pretty rough. And um, in in Final Fantasy VIII, you may think it's the same thing. So I like I like it that we have these like big chapters and and, and I think I think like I've said before I think it's unfortunate that in like the Steam version and all uh, you don't have any indication about the disc changes like you just you just have these strange peaks in the in the storyline without really I, I feel like it should be accentuated that they are you know they are. Um, like changes in a chapter in a way like of course you'll get it from the story itself but it'd be cool if it was actually actually like you had some sort of title card about it although i must say when i was looking up the the uh change disc images that come up uh between the discs in the original game in at least this one, I didn't actually check out Final Fantasy VIII or VII, but in Final Fantasy IX at least, those images are spoilers. <laughs> I guess they wanted to have like some teasers about what's going on, but there were some like spoilers in there. Of course, like out of context, you wouldn't really get what they were depicting necessarily, but. Ooh. I feel like, I'm not sure, but I feel like for disc 3 it might have been... Would it have been... 
No, for this tree, I think it showed like the destruction of Alexandria. At least from the point of view of Dagger, so. That was like, whoa. Please, game, no spoilers. Right, Kuja, you're a, you're a joke. You're even worse than Garland. Passing Demi? You know what Demi does. It does nothing. Oh, come on. Zane, please steal. Please steal. So because we are doing now, um, we're finishing this tree now, and this four is actually not that long. We might be able to finish it tomorrow. It kind of depends, but it, it might be possible for us to finish it tomorrow, which would mean that on Thursday we're going to get back to Final Fantasy Tactics. Which I'd love because uh, I want to play more of that. Oh, Zidane's gonna... Ah. Trans. Well, please steal now. So the trans doesn't go, in, go to waste completely. Nope. Like, if I had to... If I had to pick the number one thing that I would like to change about this game, it is the trans system. Um, like, the tra trans system sells very good. And, like, the whole whole story behind it and all of that, very good. But just, like, the... Just the, like, trans gauge thing is so incredibly uncontrollable. And you're just gonna end up wasting the trans. Um, I feel like it should be. I feel like it should actually be just like Terra's trans in, in Final Fantasy VI. It should just be like you have a like a shape change for a particular time that is determined by your spirit or, or whatever, um, and just like you just initiate it when you. Um, well, it could be, it could be that it, it's like a limit, limit gauge type of feel, that you need to first fill a gauge, but then that you choose to initiate it, not that the game just goes, okay, now you are in trance, um, but that you, you make a choice. Or then it could actually be similar to how Terra's trance works, which is that you can initiate it but then you have to wait a particular amount of time for the trans gauge to kind of regenerate. Uh, but you could also use it in a pinch as a very short trans. I don't know. But like anything, anything would be better than this. I'm very glad that they went back to basically just the limits Final Fantasy VII limit break system in Final Fantasy X, um, except that they added the whole, like, different overdrive modes, which I feel is, uh, like, that's that's the direction they should have gone um, already in Final Fantasy VIII, and just kept going with that. But of course, it's, it's you know, hindsight is, is uh, always a different deal. But, like, the overdrive system is far superior to, to what what these have. Eight and eight and nine. And I mean eight system wasn't bad either. But it was just very exploitable. It just meant that basically you didn't do anything except that except just attack with limit breaks. So uh Kuja, you're gonna give me your stuff? Oh! Ooh! Steiner's dead. Uh, let's do Phoenix down and Kiraga. 
What am I even trying to steal here? A light robe. Mm, yeah, I think it's... It's alright. It's alright. It's worth it. That's pretty good stuff. Who just seriously just has two attacks here? What a joke. And specifically uses Thundaga, not even like a variety of elemental spells. Just Thundaga. So... You could... Hold on. Hold on. If you actually had everybody be uh, resist... Um, yeah, resistant or absorbing thunder. We actually can't lose this battle. <laughs> if you give everyone a coral ring. Well. Why not? So I guess like this part of... This part of the fight would not be hard at all in... Um, in um, even a level 1 run. You just have some protection from lightning and Kuta would be a joke. And you could spend all your battle just stealing and watching Zidane fail at stealing. Please. Zen, please. How many tries has this been? What is the... What is the probability of this steal? I feel like I want to go check that out. What is steal? Raga Steel Let me see. Puja Battle Good and Steel. Who surprised? Let's see now. Ooh. Fine is about to be dead. There's not too much like time here in between these things, so Let's see now. Oh, <clears throat> yeah, it's lowest chance. It's a 0.39% chance. 0.39% chance. I mean, we can synthesize light ropes, can't we? Pretty sure. Because I, I think we're gonna <laughs> give up on this. And steel. Yep. Goodbye. I'm gonna let Zidane keep keep stealing, but then we're just gonna go. This was a colossal waste of time. Ha 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 ha! Yeah, you laugh. Meh, I'm just gonna go for it. We're just gonna go for it. We can get plenty of these. You call that an attack? Hey, it was even crit. Show me your true power. Show me what you got. Demi? Uh, I'll have Dagon really wait. Uh, we could bring Bahamut actually. Bahamut hurt Kuja before, so. And do it again. 
dagger will be out of MP, but I feel like we might be able to do enough damage here. The cool animation on, on Bahamut and everything. Roar. And a boom. I'm kind of trying to make mental notes constantly about these um, battles here because um, I'm planning for us to actually maybe... Ooh! Ooh! Queen is dead. Queen yeah, might be dead for the kill. Nope. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm thinking we might just do the challenge on Saturday for the charity charity stream, we might just do that without um, any sort of guide as to how to do it, and just kind of guess at how to how to do this as fast as possible. So I feel like this section overall, the end of this decree is going to be quite difficult. Because we won't be, like, this prepared. We'll probably try to get, like, a lot of good equipment, but, um... Like, we probably won't have time to go around stealing uh, from everybody. So, that's one thing. Bring it down. This dude just doesn't have any sort of AoE attacks here, so... Dagger's barely alive. I think we might go for an Ether right here. From Dagger and just get a get a full heal. Oh wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's not how Demi works. Phoenix down on Queena, and then Kiraga on everybody. Stop it. Steiner's down. Oh no, Queena's gonna trans soon. I don't want that. Phoenix down and tack. I let our health go down too much. I was thinking Kuja had less less health. Alright, there we go. And everyone's alive for this. Ugh. The times now. This is the power of trance. Oh no. <laughs> I'll show you my true power. Altabuff. No. We cannot cast that spell in this game. Well. Rip everyone. Yes. This is the power I've longed for. The mighty power of souls. They assault any threat that tries to destroy them. What, what do you mean? It's trance, you know how it works. But a normal trance won't be enough to defeat you. You're all as resilient as Arglops. Even tiny Moogles possess the power of trance. 
When I saw that in the Gulug volcano, I came up with a plan. It was easy. I just needed to borrow the power from wretched souls that can't die. Uh, did I acquire it? It was invincible. Or should I say, that large eyeball in the sky? The ship sucked up the soul of souls of Madain Sari, the ether tree, Alexandria, to feed upon them. When it fought Bahamut at the ether tree, the invincible drew in a powerful spirit. Can you guess to whom it belonged? No. That's right. It was your mother's soul. Wretched soul that clung to life to the bitter end. The souls trapped inside the invincible welcomed me with open arms. They were fed up with being your prisoners, Garland. So, Master Garland, you are no longer needed. And after you worked so hard, I shall rule Terra and Gaia with my unconditional love from now on. What will you do with such power? Master Garland, you of all people should accept defeat gracefully. Rug. How sad. Any last words? Your power is meaningless. Rah! This isn't even my final form. Now it's your turn. Should I kill you quickly to show my appreciation for all you've done? Or should I kill you slowly and painfully to show you my love? Oh, I've got a great idea. How's this? I'll make you pillars for my castle. You'll all decorate my castle as a symbol of my eternal kingdom. How do you like that? No, never. Never build an eternal kingdom. That voice. Garland? Did you leave something behind? Do you think a defect like you... What? What do you mean? Built you to last only until the worthy genome Zidane grew. It's too dangerous to let you last any longer than that. What are you saying? There's a limit on your life. You'll be dead soon enough. Even as I die, you have died without ever leaving your mark on the world. <laughs> what an interesting lie. You're telling me that my life will end soon? Ah. <sighs> Nice try, Garland, but I won't fall for your silly tricks. Garland? Garland, answer me. You were created to destroy. You were a mortal. Mortal. I'm finished? I don't believe you. Why would I believe such a silly story? You're telling me that... I'll die soon, now that I'm more powerful than anyone. I'm gonna... die? Lose my soul? Ahahahahaha! <laughs> what comedy! Zdane, isn't it hilarious? I'll die just like the black mages I so despise. I single-handedly brought chaos onto Gaia, but in the end I'm nothing but a worthless doll. Uja. Uja. I won't let it happen. I won't. I won't let this world exist without me.
Guja. I can't believe him. Zane, we gotta get out of here before every the tower collapses. But how? We need to carry the injured out too. That's still Guja's ship, the Invincible. It's at the bottom of the tower. Oh yeah. But... Alright, you guys head for the ship. I'm gonna go rescue the genomes. They're victims. I can't just abandon them. Coming with you. Dagger? I don't want you to leave us again. So I'll keep watch over you. Okay. We should be able to go back through the warp gate on the on the other tower. Dagger and I will head back to Branbar. You guys come get on get us on the invincible. Run away! I don't need to go there. Okay, fine. <laughs> um, do we need to equip anything? Uh, I don't know, but uh, let me just... Wait a minute, why do we have Asura's rod? I was wondering why it was looking kind of weird. <laughs> it's supposed to be well whisker. Doesn't really matter. But um, anyways. Run away! Okay, dark gear just really give us anything. Uh, we need to do a topaz for Ifrit. That's the big thing. And uh, Zidane doesn't have anything left. Yep. I think Zidane can just go optimize and get whatever's best. Oh! Flash Hat has eye for eye. That's the missing ability. Eye for eye is right here. Yes, 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 yes. Have to protect girls. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Well, let's go. So Kuja has a very um, Final Fantasy VII-ish... Um, well, I, I guess a lot of Final Fantasy villains have the same sort of breakdown. Looks like a teleporter leading to the upper levels. It might take us back to Brandon. Ah! What's wrong? But behind you. They're just eyes. It's okay. Let's go. Just eyes? How oh, very bold of you. Yeah, they're just eyes. Kinda creepy. Kinda following me. But they're just eyes. Um, dagger? Yes? Um, about what happened earlier. What is it, Zidane? Oh, jeez. I feel like I'm being watched. Just say it. We need to hurry. Um, you came to my rescue, right? And, uh... What you said to me made me really happy. Zidane. How can I say this? Um... Teleported. Thanks. Hurry, hurry, this stinky old tower is going to collapse any minute. I know found good food on Terra. Maybe I eat eyeball over there. Rina, hurry up or you'll be left behind. I happy we leave. No good food anywhere. <laughs> I would I would actually love it if uh, the game would do it one one last time here, where um, Queena would actually be left behind, and then you would actually find Queena back at the uh, at Q's Marsh in Living Bloom. I think we're still okay. Let's evacuate the genomes. Run! Has Queena survived some weird stuff before? Dane, let's split up. Yeah, I'll go this way. We'll meet up when the invisible ever arrives. Treasure chest. My gosh, the ship is enormous. Judging from our current position, I believe the bridge is that way. Hold it. Where's Queena? Arr! Are they late again?
Oh, 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 I arrived. I walk inside from bottom ship. Why were you underneath the ship in the first place? Save it for later. We must get the ship moving. What are you still doing here? We need to evacuate. What's the point? They're only empty vessels. Stop talking like that. Do you really believe what you just said? Unlike the rest of them, Garland gave me a soul that I might replace you and Kuja. But Garland is dead. Terra will soon be destroyed. What's the point? I asked myself the same question. Did you find an answer? No. But maybe the point is to just try. It's gonna be hard, but I've got my friends. It isn't too, so bad. Hey, what's your name? Huh? Garland gave you a name, didn't he? My name is Mikoro. Mikoro, huh? That's a nice name. A lot of people are gonna call you that from now on. You have to find the answer yourself. It'll be hard, but you can do it. Let's go to the new world, Mikoro. There, you can find your answer. Naga, where is Zidane? He'll be here any minute. He's looking for the last genome. Sorry to keep you guys waiting. Zidane! Sorry I'm late, but now we got everyone. Everyone on board now. We must leave immediately. As if Kuja couldn't just zap the invincible now. We made it. Yes, we managed to escape from Terra, but... What's wrong, Freya? Well, I was talking to Amarant about it earlier. You don't think this is the end, do you? Are you talking about Kuja? Do you really think he perished with Terra? Even with his power, it's hard to believe that he'd have escaped unscathed. What do you think, Dane? What will Kuja do next? He'll probably try to destroy Gaia. But how? There was one thing Garland said. Something about a tree that serves as a gateway of souls between Gaia and Terra. That must be. Yeah. It's the Aoife tree. Everyone. You must come, Luke. Come with me. What's up, Steiner? Can't you just tell us? It would be faster to come see it on a bridge. What's up? They're just clouds. It's not a normal cloud. What? Let's lower our altitude and see. Don't you see? Our altitude is not very high. This is all we can see. Then, what could it be? It's mist. It's what black mages are made out of, and what used to cover the mist continent. The mist has covered all of Gaia. Why? How? Uja, what are you planning now? Thanks. They were uneasy at first, but I think they'll get along fine. There's no need to thank me. You've done us all a great service. It wasn't a big deal. Well, anyway, everything's gonna be okay. Are you sure it's okay for them to stay here? Of course it is. So this was Vivi's idea. Yeah. He wanted the genomes to start their new lives here. 
who are similar in many ways, but maybe we can understand them better, and they might open up to us. Right. He also said, If you guys can get along with the genomes, maybe humans and black mages can live alongside each other someday. Like you and Vivi. I didn't even know if I truly understood him until recently. We'll take good care of them. Your friends are our friends. Thanks. Is this a monster? He's a tokobo, not a monster. He's called Bobby Corwin. Oh, you gave him a name. Yeah, Bobby Corwin. Isn't it a great name? Sounds great. Bobby Corwin. Corwin, eh? Um, Bobby Corwin, of course, is just Boko with a little <laughs> with some added letters. <coughs> I think Bobby Corwin likes you too. It won't bite. Oh, come on, he's just a little baby chocobo. Bobby Corwin, no, come back here. Wow, I think Bobby Corwin really likes our new friend. Can't you just call him by his first name? Nope. Why do you display these items? Uh, why? For the customers, I think. What are customers? Well, they bring money and they hand the money over to the shop and then... What is money? Money is a... Uh... Why do you care about small things? Well, very simple place. We'll only have two things. Things you can eat and things you know can eat. Does the water here ever stay still? Uh, water flows, doesn't it? The water of Grand Ball always, was always still. Hey, did you know that time flows, just like water? So water and time both flow in Gaia? Looks like they're off to a good start. It's like watching kids play. It's not their fault. They've only just begun to live their lives. Can lost time be recovered? I don't know, but there's only one thing we can do. Of course. We must protect them from anyone who tries to take their time away from them. Princess, is this what you really wish? Hmm? What are you talking about? Uja must have done something in the Aoife tree to cover the world in mist. Do you not think it wise to consult Regent Sid before the final battle? Uja probably plans on destroying Gaia. If I go to Lindblom now and tell the Regent about it, it might cause a panic. I'm sure everyone is apprehensive about the reappearance of the mist. I need Uncle Sid to protect Lindblom right now. Indeed. We must defeat the enemy on our own. Even if we go back to Lindblom to get equipped, Please don't tell Uncle Sid about our plans. Are we ready? Yes, let's go. You haven't got a chance. You saw Kuja's power. He destroyed a world by himself. You don't even have a million in one chance of defeating him. You'll all die. Wow, this girl knows lots of difficult words. <laughs> Doesn't she? She's a bit cynical, but take good care of her, will ya? Her name is Mikoto. She's kind of like my little sister. What? Mikoto, listen to your big brother and make some friends. How silly. We might be desperate insects, insects to Kuja, but I'll show you how powerful we can be. Even a fly lives for a day. I don't think that's what today meant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's go to the Eve tree. We won't let Kuja have his way. Oh, we got a big... No, we don't need to pick a dagger. <laughs> but, uh... I mean, yeah, we should we should not pick dagger. Uh... Freya, Echo, and, uh... Who's the lowest level? Vivi or Steiner? I kind of want Vivi and Steiner on the same team, though. Let's bring in Amaranth. Though, 
Cola. Magic sword. Airship navigation. I know how to navigate with the airship. So... Invincible doesn't have a airship theme to it. The world map no longer has the same music to it. Now it's this sad, depressing music. Sadness. But we did it. We beat this Kree. Um, and now we are in the end game, in the misty world, and um, yeah, we'll continue this tomorrow, and um, this is it for this stream. Um, I'm gonna see who we're gonna go raid, um, but we're gonna continue this tomorrow, um, and we might try to finish the game. There's still a fair amount of like side quests to and some like loose ends and and such so um might not be able to do it just tomorrow but anyway um again i want to tell you about um saturday so on saturday we're going to be doing um our first charity stream which is going to be for the humane society international so for uh for saving some animals and we'll be playing final fantasy 9 then uh we'll, we'll do a 12 hour speed run of final fantasy 9 from beginning to end uh, so all of this included, and we'll see how that goes then. Um, let's see, let's see, who do we have here? Um, let's go and, um, let's go raid your mother is a fish, who's doing some Devil May Cry. Uh, fish has been going to... Uh, the Devil May Cry series, and um, is now playing Devil May Cry 1 as the last game in the series. And then I think after that is going to be Bayonetta. So if you like those kind of games, definitely go um, go and give Fish some uh, as a, a fellow there, and we'll and pick out those streams. Well, but anyways, uh, thanks everyone for joining in on this stream, and thanks for all the raids and such, and um, I will see you tomorrow with some more Final Fantasy IX. Uh, we'll start with side quests and then, well, uh, Disc 4 is mostly just side quests, to be honest. <laughs> but anyways, bye!